Hey everyone and welcome back to God of War Ragnarok. On the last stream, we went to Svartalfheim and we actually found Tyr. So Atreus was right. Uh, he is not quite what we expected. Um, seems his uh, his mind and even his body was broken a little bit. Coming. Which means Balder. Balder is dead. Odin sent him to track down a giant in Midgard. And then he found Kratos at... Anyway... I'd promised to take these two to the tallest peak in the realms if they'd chop off my head and convince Freya to bring it back. Amir, speak of Balder. I was getting to that. It wasn't all kill this, kill that. Hey, we're back in the wetland. Alright, so anyways, I was saying his, his mind and his body seem to be broken, but I think we've sort of fixed both of those things. He's got his confidence back and he uh, magically grew back to his normal size, apparently. Uh, so anyways, I guess we're trying to get back to the dwarves now. Get Tyr out of here. Uh, now one thing I, I've been thinking about and I still don't quite understand it. I seem to be getting different results with my blocking. And I, I don't know why yet. When I was fighting the Hateful, the one that beat me up so many times. It seemed like I had to block a little bit early to get my blocks to actually work. But then when I fought the little dragon dude in the, the bog, my blocks were working instantly. So I don't know why I'm getting different results. It could be a positioning thing because the shield apparently doesn't block from the side. So maybe it's like very particular. Like even if you're a little to the side, you get hit. Or something else is going on. But I don't get it. I seem to be getting different results with my shield. Lasser got me addicted to his playstyle. I was too hyped and tried watching someone else, but they were skipping stuff and not reading the text and rushing to point A to B with not much thought. Well, welcome back, Leandro. It's good to have you. Glad you like my playstyle. I'm definitely not one who rushes. I like to take my time. Experience all the game has to offer. Also, somebody said... Oh! Somebody suggested I try fighting these barehanded. I'm gonna give that a shot. Apparently they stun easy. So let's see. Uh, or at least not when they're frozen. Do they stun at all? Okay, uh, maybe they're playing on a lower difficulty. They don't seem to be stunning very much at all. Alright, where's he at? He's apparently on the wall. We're gonna use this. Catch! Oh, get owned. Oh, there you are. Get him, Atreus. Yeah, he's... Oh, crap. Get that snot out of here. Alright, let me, uh... I want to give it an actual try before I give up on it. So let me try... Oh, dang it. Ah! Alright, well, I gotta... Screw that. I just gotta pay attention. No, you don't. Punk it over here. Dang it. Ah, I buffed up. That's not what we want. That out of here. Die. Thank you. Bloody listen. Alright, let me go back to this. Oh, wait, there's one over there? What? Wait, wait. I know he's over there. Wait, it looked like it came from the other direction. Come. We must leave before more creatures attack. You should have taken the spear. Defended yourself. No. I have abjured all violence. But you're the god of war. I left that behind long ago. Oh, Odin no. Odin starts Ragnarok. You really wouldn't fight? Not even if I wished to. We have a god of war who doesn't do war things. Not particularly useful. Wait, wasn't there a health back here? I'm gonna go back and get it. Beast scraps. Alright, so clearly my skill is improving. Those Grims would have absolutely demolished me. At the beginning of the last stream, so I've gotten better at fighting him. Um, wasn't seeing the stun results 
I was hoping to. Could have been doing something wrong. Maybe because he was frozen, he wouldn't stun as well. So I might try it again without him frozen, but I also don't want to die. Alright, anything else? How am I liking the game so far? Oh, it's fantastic. I love it. I'm having a lot of fun with it. The only thing, I was thinking about this earlier, the only thing I don't like in the first game, if you parried a ranged attack, you could throw it back at them. And I don't think that that ability exists in this game. And that's a real shame because that was super fun. But I don't think we can do that anymore. And that sucks, because that's so fun to do. And effective. So, yeah, I'm not... I, I haven't seen it anywhere. I don't know if we get that back somehow. Yeah, I'm not... Unless it's, like, down here. But this is all, like, literally axe stuff. That's a shield ability, so I, I don't know. But I'm hoping we get that back, because I miss it a lot. Before we go any further, the truth. What is it you want from me? You speak of Ragnarok. Is it a god of war you came to find? Is that the tear you need? Atreus. I... Forgive me, that I am grateful for my freedom. But if you want me to follow you to war, or worse yet, lead you to it, then kill me now. My fight is gone. Damage is done. No one's killing you, brother. Better that than to live to see Ragnarok. We do not seek war. We just want some answers. I don't know how to help you. It doesn't matter. The Giants trusted you. That's the tear we need. We need you. Good night's rest. And maybe some food. I think you killed the guards bringing me dinner. Brother, perhaps now you'd like to finish the story? Uh, the sons of Thor attacked us. We killed them. Balder tried to kill Freya. I killed him. But you skipped over how he fought and freed the Valkyries. And that the Giants are all gone. And how they called me Loki. And finding the shrines The Giants and... are gone? When we got to Jotunheim, they were all... Dead. Dead? Do you think Odin... We do not know. <laughs> I think I know where we are. We saw this barge before. <laughs> We made a big circle, basically. This is where I think it is. Uh-oh. I think we're getting out of here not a moment too soon. Whoa, what are those? Reinforcements from Asgard. The Ainuriar will want to investigate my disappearance thoroughly. Are they using the sky to travel between realms? Odin's got tricks up his sleeve we haven't dared to consider. They're coming down on neither Valir too. Will the dwarves be okay? The time for such concerns has passed. We must leave. Now. Get him! Oh, or not. <laughs> All 
Alright, Tyr, you can try fighting. Just give it a shot. You might like it. Oh, just one? <laughs> okay. They sent like eight at me in the other room, then they give me one. That's weird. Yggdrasil. It's been too long. I'd forgotten. Beauty. Tyr, in your travels, did you ever hear the giants talk about Loki? I'm sorry. That name doesn't sound familiar. The giants are... were... a very private people. Makes sense. Perhaps after a rest. Alright, so we got a new lore entry for Tyr. Uh, of the myths and legends Mimir has unfolded to us, none have so inspired Atreus as the life of Tyr. Once the god of war in these lands, he dedicated himself to peace. A hero not only to mortals of Midgard, but to those of the far-off lands of other pantheons, to which he traveled in the name of diplomacy. Even the Jotnar revere him. It is believed his aid is what made the giants disappear, escaping Odin's wrath, at least for a time. I am not certain he will prove as useful to us as Atreus hoped, either as a leader or as a source of information. Though perhaps with patience he will recover himself. Most importantly, he seeks neither war nor revenge for the suffering visited upon him. And this, I am grateful. Um. Oh, I had to actually. Uh, that did a button before? A treehouse. Lord Tear, you're really alive! Am I? I wonder. Okay. He's just tired. I promised him some food and a room to rest in. Ah, uh, of course you did. Well, let's see what we can do. Please, come inside. Uh, we'll be right in. Well, I'll be. Uh. You said that like you wanted to speak, Atreus. Apparently you don't. All right. Glad we could have this talk. So, can we talk? About what to do next? There is much to consider. We will speak in the morning. Oh. Okay. In the morning. You hold still! Yep. <clears throat> oh, much better. Thank you. See? Sleep tight, dear. I'm gonna turn in. Big day tomorrow. So, Tyr, sounds like promises were made. Let's see about getting you settled, shall we? If you'll follow me. Hey, come see what I got for you. I'm sure we won't be interrupting any goings on. I'll arrange accommodations. I may need time to construct a bed for someone of your scale. Please, don't go to trouble on my account. Too much space would be unsettling. Do you have a broom closet? Yes. But it's where I keep my brooms. That's all I need. To be honest, it's all I can manage. All right. Um, some food then. Oh, nothing much. Perhaps some hardtack. Hardtack. Any sort of humble ship's biscuit will do. I. With a pinch of salt. Well, I'll see what I can find. All right, Brock. What you want? You got the materials. I got some more stuff for you. Oh, really? So that's what's left of Tyr, huh? Back where I come from, we'd say he's been through a few things. Hmm. So have we all. Well, ain't you philosophical. You know what? They must be in the pantry. I'll just look quietly. Okay. Do we want to do any upgrades? I got a lot of hack silver. <laughs> Can't remember. Did I get another frozen flame? I did not. And I'm still needing four of those pieces of uh, the, the things I get from the hateful. I need four more of those to get a chaos flame, so can't do that. My shield's level three, so I'm happy with that. I need honed metal anyway, which I don't have. Oh, didn't mean to exit. 
Let's look at our armor. I'm wearing that. That's as far as that can go. Got the Nidavalier. Did I want to keep using this? I can't remember. It's got strength and vitality, which is good. I haven't even crafted this. Two strength. It's more defense focused. I'm not exactly the, the defense type. I don't know. I might upgrade this. Gets that 50% stun, stun drain reduction. I can't speak. Um, but I don't stun very often. Six forged iron, 1200 hack silver. Let's go ahead and bump this up to level three. A good fit. Okay. Oh, and then what do I... Actually, hold on. What do I have in my... Ah, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Um, I want to check my handles, actually. So I've still got the Furious Maul. I could bump that up to level three with Rawhide and some hack silver. Alternatively, I could go Strength and Luck. Which also... I don't know. I like the Slayer Strength. High luck chance to grant a gift of strength on any axe kill. Strength and cooldown could actually be really good, too. But so far, I'm not liking my runic attacks. They're okay. But like the first game, I probably have to invest heavily into them to make them worth it. So maybe that's something we'll do late game. But for now, I might just go strength. Uh, let's see. I wish there was a... Oh, wait. Can I see... Oh, I can see what it upgrades to. Okay, so it'll be 8 strength and 9 luck at level 3, whereas this is... Oh, that's a huge difference, though. Hmm, maybe I should craft this. Wait. Can I craft it straight to level 3? That wouldn't work, would it? I might go with this. Give up 4 strength for 9 luck. That's pretty good. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I think that's the best. Or I could go strength and cooldown. Eight cooldown. Or eight strength and nine cooldown. So it's whether I want luck or cooldown. What does it do again? Hold on. I forget exactly what luck does. Let's see, stats help. Gain additional rewards and activate chance abilities more often. Uh, I don't know. Could be good. Get my strength boost more often. I don't know. That's tough. It doesn't say how much a gift of strength actually gives. Can I sell my stuff? Yeah, I'm going to sell my, my artifacts and whatever. Oh, I can't pass up this many stats. I'm just going to go ahead and make this. But I can't craft it. Yeah, I can't craft it into the higher level, so we'll just do this. And then we'll upgrade it. Okay. Now, what do I have in my blades? Oh, I've got these things. These are awesome. Yeah, never mind. Not switching off of those. Strength and Runic. I like that. Plus increases the damage that the burn status does, although I haven't burned a whole lot of dudes. Oh, and then I've got this. Which is defense, vitality, and luck. We could upgrade that with my slag deposits. Yeah. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Let's do that. I'll put some herd on them. Cap. And I'm back to my armors. Where is that? All right, so we're wearing that. That's good. And then we upgraded this, I think. Or no, we didn't. But that's also good. What's this one? Combo finishers do increase damage. I don't remember what a combo finisher is. Strength. 
Strength and defense, or defense and vitality. I think I want to keep going strength, plus that finisher damage boost. Alright, that's forged iron. That's not a big deal. We'll go ahead and upgrade this, too. That'll keep your bits in all the right places. Alright. A good fit. That looks good. Special items, uh... I, I guess I'll buy another resurrection stone. Although they're kind of expensive. But I'll save it for a rainy day. Let's go ahead and craft it. And then sell. Sell these two. Is that? Oh. Uh, thanks for bringing this. At least here the Aner Yar can't touch it. Rebels. Dumb as bear shit, but twice as brave. Okay, I can sell my gear too, that seems silly. I spent the resources to upgrade it. <sighs> Perhaps I'll be able to sleep tonight. Really sleep. The sleep of a free man without the All Father's eye on me. Where did Sentry go? I don't know. Did they go in here? Yes, but I can't go in there. What are you thinking, brother? I am thinking. I want things to be the way they were. Well, I'd like to claim a tree again. Certain ships have sailed. I just wish Atreus were not so... restless. I care only for your safety. I know, brother. But holding him too tight won't keep him out of danger. The lad's determined to make a few mistakes of his own. And I hate to say it, but I think Tyr might be one of them. I've never seen a man broken so completely. His pain is fresh. You expect too much. Aye, perhaps. Pretty Freya still wants to kill you. That's an ally we could use. That is not an option. No. I don't suppose it is. Trouble sleeping. Ah! Shh. You cannot sneak up on me like that. There's something I had to do in Midgard. What? Without me? I thought we were partners. We are. Just wasn't sure you'd want to join me. I'm visiting. An old friend. Oh, I see. Or possibly not doing that, taking into account she's determined to murder you. She wouldn't really. Oh, look, I think it's lovely that you see the best in people. I really do. And I want you to continue to see the best in people by not getting yourself murdered. <gasps> but we need her. It's worth the risk. Is it, though? No way. I'm Atreus? How about I suggest an alternative? Something much less risky, but maybe could give you some answers. What are you talking about? A certain old friend you haven't seen in a while. A very giant friend. Well, this was you not expected. Gander? Did you find him? Why don't I show you? It's just on the way to the vengeful goddess who wants you dead. So it'll give us some time to decide about not going there. So, you know where Freya is? No, no. I mean, yes, but look, let's just talk to the snake first, and then I won't take you to Freya. How's that sound? The path old friends started. Yeah, I was really not expecting to be controlling Atreus. Enter the Mystic Gateway. Why are we sneaking? No one's gonna see us over here. Ah. <sighs> 
<laughs> the little mushroom dudes over there. <laughs> I love those little guys. All right, well, what can Atreus do on his own? Glad you brought your key of Yggdrasil. I seem to have dashed out without mine. Huh, you got sick of having house guests that fast? What? No, I could just use some fresh air, is all. Well, I hope you like it cold. Should we swing by your cabin first? Will your furry friend be joining us this time? Uh... No, I, I meant to tell you. Fenrir's dead. Oh... I'm very sorry to hear that. As wolves go, he was always... very clean. Thanks. I'd offer to give you a hug, but... why traumatize either of us further? Oh man, that would have been awesome to have Fenrir as my companion. Okay. Caught a whiff of something awful near the Helheim Tower. Remember how to get there? Yep, just past the Oarsmen. But that's what makes you think Jormungandr's nearby? I know what I smelled. Okay. Well, a lot's kinda happened. And I need answers. Oh, is that where? Is that frozen lightning? Yep. Want a closer look? No. Is that where we fought? It must be. Alright, interesting. All right, Atreus has bow and arrow. That's expected. He's got, he's got a runic attack. What is that? Let's see, I've got the Talon bow, Hunter Insight one, increased stun from melee attacks and bow shot, so he can also melee. Regular arrows are fired normally. Atreus's bow made out of a yew tree by Atreus's mother. He has finally grown into it. Uh, and then we have our bow ability, Stinging Barrage. Fires a powerful single shot of several arrows at once that collide with heavy impact. Okay, so it seems like he has one weapon. Oops. I could increase that with the little experience I have. Probably want to wait on that. Uh, armor. Brothers brand vestment. Armor crafted with care by the legendary Holdra Brothers, said to be one of their finest works. Oh, I've got a few options. Hmm. Kind of like that look, to be honest. This one... Well, it's nifty. I don't... No, no, I kind of like him more like a ranger. Anyways, uh, other options. Risen Snow Tunic, a tunic inspired by the elements of... Fimble Winter and granted to those with faith in the future and survival garb. Armor meticulously crafted over the course of two winters that is now ready for the path ahead. I might go with this. I kind of like that. Let's go with the Risen Snow Tunic. Alright, and then my skills. Oh, just opened up a bunch. So we have the instinct ones we saw before. That tree's gotten a little bit bigger. And then archery and aggression. What's this? Sonic explosions caused by Atreus have an increased area of effect. Well, whether I can use that on my own or not, I want that. So I will purchase it. But what about this stuff? Rushing descent. While sprinting, press R1 to perform a leaping attack. With a bow. Feels like that would break it. Breaching bash. While evading, hold the left stick forward and press R1 to perform a shield strike, dealing... High stun. Shield strike. I don't have a shield. It's a bow strike. Uh, okay. Bludgeoning strikes. Hold R1 to trip and strike an enemy. Continue holding R1 to deal heavy stun by extending the duration of the beatdown. That seems pretty cool. That's probably what I'll... Let's try this one. I'll try that. Alright, we'll start with this. Can he actually block? 
Ooh. Oh, that's a cool block. I like that. The chest. <laughs> Not so easy, huh? Shut up! Oh, bet you I could shoot that for hack silver. Oh, shattered room. Nice. It use so if I hold, hold on, so I can. Oh, it uses it regardless. So I do sonic arrows with every shot. So does that mean I can only do three and then I have to wait? So, what's been going on? Sonic arrows consume arrow charges that recharge over time, okay. So, father said I cast a spell when Fenrir died, but I don't know what he's talking about. Accidental magic? That is disquieting. <laughs> hmm. That seems like it needs to be burned away. Ugh. Lift's broken. I'll fix it later. I assume my sonic burst doesn't work. Yeah. Yeah. Accidental magic's not all. I sort of turned into a bear. A bear? Including the slobber. Yeah. Then I lost control. Frey knows magic better than anyone. She could help me. But not giant magic. Fine. We'll do it your way then, Sin. A huge venomous snake seems much safer. It's... venomous? <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can go up this way. What is this? I wonder if I could shoot that. Yeah. Hey, it worked. Rawhide, beast scraps, and hack silver. <laughs> Press L2 plus R1 to use limited regular arrows while the sonic arrows, area, eh, arrows recharge. Told you I can't speak tonight. Alright, so apparently I can just do that. There we go. Okay. So I have unlimited arrows, really. Shoot the barrel. It's got soundstone on it, too. Yes! Feels good, right? It's great, Sindri. Alright, what's this? Oops. My arrows don't seem to drop at all. It's that god power. Slide deposits. Okay. For block. How'd the arm of tear statue end up here? Find a way through, and I'll tell you. I'm on it. Huh. Looks dwarven. Heck, silver. What's this? No way I'm lifting that. Maybe with some help? Well, don't look at me. Who knows where it's been? <laughs> Come on, Sendry. Eh, fine. It is soundstone, but the path's still blocked. I don't see any more on this side. Hold on. Let me look around. Maybe I need a different angle. Oh, thought I could go through. Okay, so now that I'm here, there we go. So, Tyr's arm. Your father owed Thora blood payment. And, well, he died. Wow, great story. <laughs> anyway, is that likely to happen again? Sudden, uncontrolled 
bear rampage? Beats me. Oh, we got Draugr. Hi, right, Atreus. We've got company. Got my back? They're literally made of filth. I'm not touching. Who said you need to touch them? I like the way you think. Okay, here goes nothing! That's some quality craftsmanship! Okay, so far he's working all right. I don't like his dodge very much. It's more of a sidestep. I do like that stunning shot, though. Oh, that's pretty nifty. That worked out. Ooh, he's good. The kid's got skills. Okay, right. I'll just... Take this, you dirty pile of rocks! Ah, don't touch me! Wow, Sindri, harsh work. Not sure he'll recover. Shut up. Do you want my help or not? All right, all right. <laughs> okay, I'm actually really liking Atreus. <laughs> he's got skills, and he stuns really easily. Block is solid too. <laughs> I like Sentry's backup too. Why is my ability not working? Yeah, that sidestep is pretty nifty. I like that. Woo, smooth. For sacrificing so many objects from your bag of tricks. Well, you clearly need the help. Oh, uh, whatever. All right, I'm liking that. What's this? Oh, it's in the bramble crap. Okay. <laughs> I'm so proud. Oh, he's getting better at breaking chests. I think the lift switch is broken. You can fix it, can't you? Or does your brother have all the talent after all? Depends. Is your father all the muscle? If I say yes, you realize you're confirming Brock has all the talent? Pull that out of his pocket? Let's get going. <laughs> What's this other crap he pulled out? He pulled out a pillow and a... What is that? A little handbag thing? Why are you worrying so much today? I just need to look out for the people I care about. It keeps bad things from happening to them. Freya wouldn't kill me. Oh. And Jormungandr's probably not even there. Besides, he likes me. He's only eaten me once. I had conveniently scrubbed that from my memory. Well, we're here. Huh, wonder if there's any way I could have gotten that. It was an artifact down below. Told you he's gone. Well, have you tried calling him? Blowing the horn's the first thing we try. 
I'm not talking about the horn. Your mute you no. That's not weird at all. Anything? Good talk. <coughs> Ironwood. What do you think it means? It means we should have stayed home. Let's head back. Yeah, that gunk all over him, poor Sentry. Jormungandr! New Codex entry. I assume he's under friend. Friends and foes, that's interesting. Why would he be both? We haven't seen Jormungandr since Fimble Winter began. I was beginning to think he'd left the Lake of Nine, somehow. But Sentry's nose was right. The World Serpent woke up when I called, but when I asked him about Loki and what I should do, all he said was... Jean Vidir, which I'm saying wrong. Not helpful. No idea what Ironwood means, but it was still nice to see him again. Alright, any other barrels I could potentially shoot? Aha! What's that? I can't tell. Yeah. Eh, it's not. Door's frozen. Maybe I can. Dude, you're gonna break Would your you pole. Just let me do it? So, what was your plan anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah, exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck! Don't tell Brock I cursed. He's unbearable when he's smug. Look, Balder tried to kill her. We had no choice. Not sure she sees it that way. 
Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. Rawhide, beast scraps, and hack silver. Nice. Wait a minute. Why aren't you exploding? Okay, I guess my arrows are weak. Aha! I thought I saw something. Slag deposits. I like that the uh, the buckets in this game have more than hack silver because I'm pretty sure in the first game it was just hack silver and there's definitely a fight coming. That is such a fun move. Why is why is uh, Atreus get the best freaking runic attack? He's way stronger than, than Kratos. <laughs> Attack fire boss to cause an explosion, removing debris and damaging enemies. Forged iron, beast scraps, and hacks. Sorry, Sendry. <laughs> I guess there was nothing there. Probably should have warned him. Yeah. Well, that's quite enough excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh. Oh dear. Oh, I haven't Maybe tried my trip move yet. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. Hi. Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet vessel, I wish it did. <gasps> See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again, if that's what you're asking. <sighs> My shot! Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. <laughs> I love the way you pull stuff out of that bag. New skills available. All right, I still got to try that tripping thing because I forgot about it. Uh, we'll worry about the other skills as I I want to I don't want to grab a bunch of skills and then forget to use them and incorporate them into my play. So I'm going to try the trip first. But yeah, I don't have Sentry. That makes me sad. Sentry was quite powerful with his bombs. So this. I don't think I can break this. I need to find another way around. All right, we can go up. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. I think she's going to use Atreus to get to Kratos. That's my prediction. Oh. Please. Just keep going. I think Sentry was trying to tell me to hit it. I beat him to it.
Oh, wait. Okay, it was just a regular bird. I thought I heard a raven. Are you sure this is a good idea? You haven't got a plan. Brock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. <sighs> Okay, now which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah, sounds right. <laughs> you think they're gonna be uh, besties, huh? Clearly. Bucket over there. One of those golden chests at the top. It's interesting. Might be able to knock this thing down. Maybe. You're alive, aren't you? You are alive. Can I do any sort of sneak attack? Let's see. Nope. <laughs> Man, that sidestep he does is so smooth. All right, I was gonna try the uh, the sweep. <laughs> Dude, he's fun to play. He's really fun to play. Let's see, which one of you are alive? Not him. He is. Oh crap, I uh, pissed them all off. That's not good. Oh, and now I'm letting them buff up. It's time to see how good Atreus really is. Crap, I couldn't stop that. All right, now we're in trouble. Now things are gonna get interesting. Uh oh. Oh god, three of them. I love three of them buff. That's not great. So smooth though, he just weaves in and out. Yeah, he just easily sidesteps them. Oh, crap. What? Okay, that one should not have hit me. Why? Hold on, I gotta see the replay on that one. What? That didn't even touch me. Oh, that was some BS. Wow, that wasn't even close. Oh, that was some crap. That was not even close to hitting me. Alright, well, anyways. Apparently I gotta be careful with that attack, because it lies. Alright, the problem is I don't have... Oh, he's not dead. There he goes. Oh, he's buffing up while I did that. Well, it's only one. Oh, I stunned him or whatever. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh wow, headshots do a ton of stun, I just realized that. Okay, well, I've learned that we have to be very careful with that stupid slam attack, because it hits a larger area than it visually shows. Or at least it did there. 
Got some shattered runes. That's good. All right. More soundstone. A lot of that material around that we can blow up. Can I drop a bomb? No. Wow. You need to destroy the sonic piece first. Oh. Oh. Wait, can I shoot while... Well, how do I get out of here? Maybe I can go down? Wait, what's this? There we go. There we go. Alright. Just need to get a different angle on the sound stuff. What am I hearing? It's not a raven, is it? Regular bird? I'm not sure. I think it's a regular bird. I think the Odin ones make a different sound. Oh, crap! Oh, rude! Bash him! Bash him! Oh. <laughs> Hey, Drew. Been loving the G G God of War streams. Not able to watch these days, but have been catching up on uh, with them later. It's been fun to watch. Glad to hear. And welcome to the stream tonight, at least. For as long as you can stay. It's good to have you. hit the thing so I should be able to go up. If father could see me now, he would lose it. Oh yeah, Trace, you're screwed when he finds out. I wouldn't out. have to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> He's arguing with himself. <laughs> First time here, Isaiah, welcome to the Maybe stream. if you listen to me, could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? Yeah, am I supposed to go from here? Oh, here we go. I like- oh! I like that his attack slows down time so he can actually land it. Him right over the edge. All right, where is that dude? There he is. <laughs> oh my God, Atreus is so much fun to play. This is great! Oh crap, I thought I killed him. There we go. Yeah, see that projectile? There it is. Oh, there's two of them up there! Oh crap! You boys want some of this? Kinda like the regular arrows better. They go fast, they do a lot of damage. I don't know. Kinda like the regular ones. Let's see. Ah crap. I do come. Alright, finish him off. Good. Yeah, this is freaking awesome. Oh, this is so much fun. I, keep going up. I legitimately like playing Atreus more than Kratos. <laughs> his his attacks have so much more impact. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? It just flows so naturally. 
Okay, so obviously I can knock that down. Oh, I could have dropped him out, I think. Let's see. Yep. Yeah. Well, that would have been helpful. Alright, let's pick up a new ability for him, because I am using the other one now. So let's see, which one do we want to experiment with now? We got the rushing descent. Always ha the the sprint attacks are always useful, but what else we got? The breaching bash. Do a lot of stun. Maybe. Rushing ascent while sprinting press R2 for a heavy vertical attack that launches enemies. I don't know if getting enemies airborne with a trace is as good. Evasive marksman while evading, hold the left stick back and press R1 to shoot backwards and shoot oh that looks freaking awesome i might have to do that let's see what else we got though high ground wow what the heck kind of combo is that a powerful heavy attack finisher at the end of the light attack combo <laughs> r1 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 r2 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 <laughs> maybe it feels like it would leave me still for too long but it looks cool imbued assault hold r2 to swing the bow for a wide heavy attack, applies status damage of the currently equipped runic arrow. I'm thinking I want to try evasive marksman first. What else do we have over here, though? Sonic echoes. Attacking enemies afflicted with Atreus' sonic status creates bigger reverberations, applying stun to nearby enemies. Oh, that sounds freaking good. And then this one, stranglehold. That's when I'm with uh, Kratos. Yeah, all the wait, what's this? Dive into battle. Press triangle to grapple towards an enemy and strike them with force. Apply status damage of the currently equipped runic arrow. Highly effective at closing the gap to mobile enemies. I do like the look of that. Alright, so there's a few I actually want here. I'm going to try the evasive arrow first. Evasive marksman. So let's try this one. And then I kind of want to grab Sonic Echoes too, because that just seems like a good thing to have. Although I haven't applied the status too effectively yet. So maybe I wait on that. Let's wait. Okay. Uh, what are we doing again? We've got this. Beast Scraps. Is this where it came from? Yeah, that's where I came from. Any buckets? We got a bucket up top. I don't see a bucket anywhere else. Huh. Could burn away that, maybe, if I had fire arrows, which I don't. Oh! What the? Oh! Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Not cool. Slide deposits. Nice. Hmm. Two ways I can go. Rawhide, Beast Scraps, and Hack Silver, and then this way is blocked. Oh, so dear. What the heck did you get in here? Oh, what's this? Hack Silver. Bucket over there. I assume we're gonna go around. I haven't been knocking down the buckets as I see them because I had one bucket whose item seemed to disappear, so I've just been waiting until I get to the actual place. Man, that's so good for stun. Oh my god. <laughs> I love it. I freaking love it. Guess I'm 
going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. All right, where was that bucket? It's near here. Yappa! Easy. Oh, did I break the bucket? No, this is a different spot. Chest through there. Where is that bucket? Oh, uh, maybe I had to shoot it to have it drop down to where I could get it? I don't know. We'll go a little bit further and figure it out. Oh, he's shielded. Oh, there another one? There he is. Hold on. Did that work? No, that's not gonna work. Oh, he's blocking me with a jerk. Oh crap! It's like parry them or something. What? Oh, there it is. Hold on. Wait, it only worked once. There it is. Oh, I like that. I like that. Oh, dang it. I tried to hit him. That didn't work. That's not good. Yeah, look how much stun that does. Oh, I can... Oh, wow. You can charge it up for a massive hit. I didn't know that. Oh, wait, what? He's got a ranged attack? <laughs> He's gone. That charge of attack is good. All right, beast scraps. Why would I get beast scraps from a dragger? He seems like he's alive. I don't trust it. I don't mean he's dead. What about you? Alright. Alright, I want to backtrack and figure out where that bucket was. Wait, unless this was it? Oh, this was it. There's that bucket. Yeah, this is definitely it. Okay. No backtrack needed. See any way to break this? Oh, 
Oh, there we go. Get away from me. I got this, right? Yeah, I got this. Oh, I could have blown that up to get them. Oh, whatever. Oh. Well, I've got just the thing for you. One shot. <laughs> Rhea shouldn't be much farther now. Just need to look out for that big door. All right, there was a bucket over here, I think. Oh, no, it was a bomb. Still didn't see that artifact we passed on the elevator. Forged iron, bee scraps, and hex silver. Yep. Is that That's you the up door. There? Hello down there. Hey! Come to your senses yet? Yes. I mean, uh, I'm not changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts. <gasps> hey! Like you never do? Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that, but by all means, keep going and you might find those too. Atreus versus the hateful? If she starts killing you. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Atreus would dominate the hateful. He could just pluck him at range. It's nothing the hateful could do. I mean, technically, Kratos could do the same thing, but Atreus is much more effective at range. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? Are we I mean, gonna have to fight just Freya? Because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean. Okay, yeah. Probably would mentioning that. Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh, I'm so dead. Dude, take the necklace off, <laughs> you dummy. <laughs> what? Is there a reason he's wearing it that's like practical, or is he just playing with fire? <sighs> I can't remember. Here goes nothing. It's good luck. Not in this case. you? No! 
He doesn't know. You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? You're better than this. Take your life on it. <clears throat> what do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, <clears throat> save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin. <clears throat> nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us. Offered peace if we don't move against him. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Gro's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The Giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. In Jotunheim, you learn the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And, and that's not all. The Giants have prophecies about me. They know me as... Loki. I think maybe... I'm supposed to... help stop Odin. Somehow. But since all the Giants are dead and... you won't fight Odin... then he's already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. But we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Here is alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Swartalfarn. Impossible. The nine realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together... Enough. Enough! Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. You messed up, Atreus. You messed up. All right, we got an entry for Freya. Well, our chat wasn't all I hoped for, but it actually could have gone much worse. At least now I know she doesn't want to kill me. Not really. She seemed interested to learn about Odin visiting and Tyr being alive and me being the last giant. And especially about realm travel being unlocked. Really not sure what she's going to do next, but hopefully it won't be using all the information I just gave her to attack us again. Yeah, I really didn't think this through. Well, at least he knows he's an idiot. <laughs> Maybe this will make Kratos angry enough to drop a boy. <laughs> Maybe drop a boy off a cliff. <laughs> Just 
Sonic Aftershock accessory. Scratch the metal from Tears Temple fused with soundstone echoing the warrior's spirit. How do I use it? What? Okay, hold on. Wait, is it going armor? Oh, it goes in armor. Oh, I get three accessories. Melee attacks have an enemy of... Wait, melee attacks against an enemy afflicted with Sonic. Deal bonus stun. Upgrades increase the stun dealt. Scraps of metal. Okay. Kratos didn't see him leave. I don't know how he didn't see him leave, because we were being quite loud, but he didn't, presumably. Okay, so I'm not dead. I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. Which I will never, ever admit this injury. Wait, make sure there's nothing. Okay. Good thing I like climbing. Shannon is Atreus and Kratos or Aloy for the best climber? Aloy. She climbed some crazy stuff. Or throw Bayek in there. Bayek and Aloy probably about died. Oh, thank Amir. You're all right. How did it go? I was starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's going to help us. Ah, uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh. I was thinking, and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... I just fixed that! Oh my god. I've still got my bag of tricks. If you need me, I'll be... Standing oh, back here. I didn't even see that attack coming. Oh crap, where'd you come from? Stay away. Oh, he buffed up. Oh, well, doesn't matter. I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean... I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. Oh? I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Alright, wasn't that a new... I don't think we've fought the big Draugr yet, have we? Let's see. 
Are you under monster? Huh. I don't think we got a entry for him. Yeah. Weird. that I don't need. Alright, any barrels in the lake? Oh, that's where we came from. Never mind. I know where we are. Huh. Oh, we're back. Do they ever quit? Nightmares! I'm gonna be sick! Oh, one shot him. And there's so many. Oh, didn't see him coming in. You're not Crap. Heavily, are you? Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Oops. Okay, back to Alfheim Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. Wait, what? I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. Wait, what does that even mean, though? So Brock is like three-fourths of a person? Oh, wait, and wasn't the... We never did find that artifact. Maybe we come back later. Wait, what's that up there? I thought I saw something. Rock is three fourths alive and one fourth dead. Is that why he's blue? <laughs> oh, guess we'll find out. Couldn't go that way before. I assume Sendry's willing to help this time. Or no. Guess not. He turned blue because of a smithing accident? They said that in the first game? Or in the previous game? I don't remember them saying that, but I'll take your word for it. I'm definitely gonna not I'm definitely not gonna remember minor details like that at this point. Good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. Wait, what am I hearing? Oh, I think I'm hearing the gateway up there. What do you mean? A choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night.
Trey. Trey? It's a... Shut up. He's got a nickname now, Trey. Alright, maybe we'll get to that artifact we saw earlier. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. Huh. Maybe. All right. Shall we? Maybe if I go down this way? I don't know. We might just come back later and grab it if I can't get it now. Because this just went around and over here. Yeah, I don't. I don't remember. We'll we'll come back later and get it. I don't think we can get it now. There was an entrance you could press on on the middle of the elevator ride. Well, let me see. If I can get it now, I will. Might be too late. Might have to come back. Is it here? No, that just leads back down. I don't remember anymore. It was a while back. We'll come back later. <laughs> you should just call him boy. <laughs> I think he's heard enough of that in his life. I think he's ready to move past that name. Let's go. I hate coming home empty handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to- Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe, but Father's not going to go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. <laughs> I'm thinking he's waiting right as we walk through. Go, go, go. No, I guess not. He says slip around back. <gasps> no? Alright, I'll do the front door then. That is not the risk that concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? I trust their wisdom. And this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the Giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. this sausage uh, sure why not I remember food tasting better I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot I accept what uh. I'll try us where I planning our next move oh so where are we going? Alfheim. I'm with the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are seeking information. 
the shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? I wasn't sure you, um... Never mind. That's great. How fun. Hey, don't go forgetting this what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> More for me. Here, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. So, oh, where did this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we set to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of our talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. And thanks to you as well, Brock. These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight! And never mind what Brock had to trade the landlord to get that Intrasil seat. The landlord? He's not the landlord! <laughs> uh, okay. I'm not gonna say anything else. I'll give it a sec. Make him look around the table. No, nope, we're just all gonna eat quietly and slightly awkwardly. Alright, getting up. Oh, I'm back to Kratos. Kratos, you didn't finish your food! What kind of warrior does that? Ugh, oh, I'm so disappointed. Anything I can get around here? Yeah, hey, what's that thing? That's cool. Ready when you are, Father. That was a good character transition. I know, right? I had no idea I had switched. Alright, open this up. This will be of use. Be scraps. What's up, Sendry? He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? All right, well, I'm, I'm already upgraded my gear. I'm not going to do it again. Uh, I do have experience, uh, quite a bit of experience. Probably get some new skills. Uh, what's this? Skill mods unlocked. Mod tokens amplify an aspect of a skill. Select a skill with an open mod token slot and press X to view it. Oh. Interesting. Slightly increase the damage of the... What does it say? Skill mods unlocked. Uh, unlock mod tokens for a skill using experience. Freely change the token on a skill once unlocked. 
Experience granted. Purchase a skill mod now. So, with Front Rush, I can give it more damage. I can give it more stun or protection. Greatly increases resistance to damage after being staggered during skill. Uh, I mean, I usually go for damage. It's not really an ability I would use for stun. It could be. But I think I'll just go for damage. Okay. Oh. oh, and that's right. The more I use this stuff, the better it becomes. This one's already gold. Oh, I think I have to get it to gold and then I get a, a damage token thing or a, a mod token for it, maybe. Maybe that's the deal. Yeah, I don't know. All right, let's see. Serpent Snare. Hold R2 for a brutal axe attack that throws an enemy, blah, blah, blah. I was actually going to try this Glacial Rake. It seems relatively fast. I think I could get this off. So let's grab that. Vengeful Sickle. Aim and hold R1 to charge up the Leviathan Axe. All right, that one. The evading strike, maybe. Whirling storm. I don't know. What do I got for the blades? Scorched earth. Press R2 during flame whiplash to spike the blade down and create a heavy burn explosion. That could be good. Well, I haven't used flame whiplash a lot because it leaves me immobile. But against a single enemy, I should probably use it more. If Flame Whiplash is fully charged, trigger a hazard of smaller follow-up explosions. Or Immolation. Perform melee attacks in quick succession without sustaining damage to power up the Blades of Chaos and inflict burn damage on every hit. Oh yeah, we definitely want that. Give me that. Give me that. Hyperion Grapple. After Oh, I actually wanted to try this. After impaling an enemy with Hyperion Pool, hold R1 to launch forward towards grounded... Wait, grounded enemies. Oh, it means one's not in the air. Yeah, yeah. To cause an impact with high stun, airborne enemies are instead slammed to the ground. Yeah, yeah. Grab this. We'll play with those two. Oh, and this is a new one. What's this? Rising Chaos. Hold R2 to swipe the blades upward and launch nearby enemies into the air. Okay, we'll take that too, actually. Oh, wait. I have that. Never mind. Uh, it seems good for now. What's Atreus' new abilities again? Stranglehold 1. Atreus grabs enemies for longer and enhances powerful strikes caused by Kratos against his grab target. Yeah, let's do that. And then I forgot about my relic. I think I can actually level this thing up. But 2,500 is not cheap. And let's wait till I get a better relic maybe all right I believe we're ready right behind you I'll meet you at the gateway presently friends Kratos suspects something Can I still not go in the backyard? Guess not. Excuse me, sir. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. <laughs> My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Uh, this must be the squirrel that tends the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Mm. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squid ink. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait. If you're ratted Hosker. Why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. 
But you are correct. I am indeed Ratatosker. The one you know as Ratatosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And the particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of, Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off, I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway, <clears throat> now that I've polished off all this regimen for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. <clears throat> Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. <sighs> ah, so that's why good Master Brock needed an Alpine seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. Realms of possibility, paths split like branches of the Yggdrasil. Alfheim awaits with a long and difficult journey. The training grounds of Niflheim hold secret rewards. Svartalfheim may hold unfinished business. Choose carefully. New seeds, new Yggdrasil seeds for Alfheim and Niflheim have been acquired. Choose a realm to travel to. Hmm. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places. A realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. Well, I'm definitely going to go to one of these other Sportal ones. Time remains at your disposal if you have unresolved business amongst the dwarves. I do, but I need that thing that lets me manipulate the air blast things. Muspelheim. New Yggdrasil seeds for Alfheim and Niflheim have been acquired. Choose a realm to travel to. Well, I'll leave it up to you guys. Niflheim or Muspelheim? Let's do a, let's do a poll. Which destination? Niflheim. I'm probably spelling it wrong, but deal with it. Or Muspelheim. The poll has been started. Choose our destination. Did I spell it right? No, I added an E. I spelled the other one right, though. Oh, wait. I can't actually go there, can I? Oh, I derped. At least I don't think I can go there, but it has a favor there. Available quests. Well, never mind. This is a pointless poll anyway, but you guys wanted to go to Niflheim regardless, so I guess that worked out. Alright. The illusion of choice. Mwahaha. Alright, so Niflheim. Realm available to travel. Press X to open the map. Yggdrasil seeds collected. One. Available quest. The Eyes of Odin, which is our ongoing Kill the Ravens quest. Let's go to Niflheim. The Path of the Mist. Ratatoskr's Realm Seed leads to the Niflheim Training Arena. Travel here for a place to practice and improve. Oh, wait, so is this the new Muspelheim? Well, we're going to the Raven Tree. Sure. Confirm. If we're not going to Alfheim yet, it's probably best for Tyr to wait for us here. The soldiers we fought in Svartalfheim, those were Enriar? I thought Enriar were just spirits in Valhalla until Ragnarok comes. They were no spirits. Indeed, brother. Odin appears to have found a loophole. Activated his forces early as a standing army. Perhaps something he could only do without any honest Valkyries around to stand in his way. Alright, so we got some new codex entries. One was for Ratatasker. There he is. A large and extremely talkative squirrel. Claims to take care of the world tree. He is overly familiar, yet seems harmless and benevolent. His spectral aspects have aided us before and may again. 
He revealed that the stone given to Atreus by Denir was a seed for use in realm travel. If he continues to prove useful, I may tolerate his excessive blather. And I think that's it. There was another one that popped up, but what was it? I don't know. Hmm. Is it in here? Oh, I don't think I ever looked at the in Einharyar Brute. Hardly a more fitting title than Brute, although perhaps applicable to more than one rank of Odin's soldiers. If memory serves, this title was granted if a newly incarnate Inher or Einherjar completed some feat or other. Last I heard, it was accomplished by wearing the jaws of ten enemies that had been ripped from their owner's heads with their bare hands. Did we see this before? No, we saw this one before. Yeah. All right, I don't know of anything else. Is it Dragor? No, that was there before. Yeah, I don't know. This looks interesting. The Raven Tree. Hello, Brock. Do we have to be here? Creeping me out, all these poor bastards with their souls cut up. Brock, what do you think about fate? I don't. Either your life's all written down somewhere or it ain't. Still feels like you're making choices either way. Shit smells the same regardless of how it got shat. Remind me to write that down. Okay, I got no need of his services currently. Yeah, this is this looks like There's the uh, over here. Ah, a memory of war. You could use this as a training arena if you like. You'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies. They won't be able to harm you. So yeah, it is like Muspelheim in terms of this little shrine pillar thing. Sparring arena. One is Draugr training. The sparring arena allows you to test and hone your skills in combat. In the arena, you have infinite health and accelerated cooldowns. Note there is no experience or hack silver gain in the arena. There's also Grim training. I don't, I don't need to train unless there's a trophy or something. I was hoping there'd be like trials though. Wait, are those Odin Ravens? The ones we've been destroying all this time? So it would seem. Free are we. Free of the Father. Our half lives now. What do you think that means? I don't know, but there's definitely something more going on here. All right, I assume. Oh, I probably have to like free so many. Yeah, nine of forty-eight for that one. Oh wait, thirty-eight for that one. I have nine. This one doesn't tell me. Twenty-eight. There we go. What we got? Girdle of Raven Tears. A gift in death to his mother forever. The All Father's breath. Their thoughts. I can't read them. They seem to like us, though. One hopes. I suppose we should continue to destroy any of Odin's ravens when we find them. Okay. Uh, let's see. New armor. Waste armor. The Girdle of Raven Tears. Defense and luck. Meh. Increases the healing from health stones, rage, and gear. Healing increases 15%. Heavily fortified armor that is said to be stronger than the hardened ice of Niflheim. Yeah, I don't... That is a lot of stats, though. Holy crap. 
That's significantly more stats than mine. Hmm. That's one reason to potentially use it. But I'd be giving up that strength. I'd gain 10 defense and 9 luck, though. Plus, the increased healing is not bad. I don't know. I might not be able to pass up that big of a gain. That's significant. I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it. Could you upgrade it? I could, uh, but it's already level 3, so it's the same level as the waste I have, but it has that many more stats. That's hard to pass up. Alright, so obviously we want to return here every time we kill a certain number of ravens. I think I get the next one at 18? Let's see. Oh, 12. We're close. 12, and then 18, and then I think it goes up by 10s from there. This one's 48. 28, and I think this one's 38. Yeah. Alright, well I guess that's all there is to Niflheim. Just a place for the ravens and the training. Expanded my wares. If you got the raw materials to make them. Don't forget you can compare the gear by pressing I3. Yeah. It's not like it's hard to remember those stats. Alright, so I do it some point want to go back to Svartalfheim, but we're not going to do that until we get whatever that tool is that we're missing. What's this? Oh, that's Sendry's house. Never mind. Oh, return to Sendry's when ready. Why can't I just go right there? Oh, I guess I need another seed or something? Alright, well. Let's go. Mimir, I know this sounds weird, but can you tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul, and every soul has four parts. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the Lake of Souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light. So that's where Fenrir is? The Lake of Souls? So long as his soul still has its direction, aye, it's well on its way. Ah, there you are. I knew you hadn't forgotten me. Travel to Alfheim. Master Kratos, I would speak with you. Oh? Well, hello. Here. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? How do I throw it? Oh, it's just throw your axe, dear. I was, uh, I was distracted because freaking, uh... Atreus was talking to Tyr as I started this conversation. A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. Well, any questions before you travel on? I have a question. Splendid! I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons? Oh no, young master Atreus. Those are leaned worms, the brood of Neithhode. Neithhode? That's the mother? Correct. She's also a vital piece of the Yggdrasilian circle of life, as it were. I tend the branches up here, while Neithhode chews the roots from below to prevent overgrowth. A delicate balance. So they're friendly? Well, they're not nearly so affable as myself, but there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace. Neithhog is a stern matriarch, as protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds... Familiar. <laughs> if you keep hitting I the chimes... I suppose I needn't take up more of your time. If you keep hitting the chimes, he gets pissed off. That's funny. We'll have to try that sometime later. Alrighty. Any reason for me to go back in the house?
What's up, bro? Nah. They're just housekeeping. Let's go. Off to Alfheim. Uh, the Strand. A long journey awaits through Alfheim's gate. Travel when ready or explore other realms to prepare. I am prepared. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves. Sure, I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever realm traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, Light Elves came back. We seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Oh, Tyr seems to think otherwise. What was secret? It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa's shrine. Reach Groa's shrine atop the temple. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. New rune read, broken history. Graffiti in dark elf territory next to a statue of their ancestors. The elves before the division of light and dark. The message being, what exactly? And for who? Either the elves have seen the statue and ignored it, or they're more concerned with mastery over the light. Wait, what's that? Nothing. I see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alfheim. Oh, fun. Yikes. Thimble winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble winter. Okay, well, what's in here? <gasps> Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. Yeah, well. It's in pain. Maybe I need to go back after all. There's something down there, maybe? Hex over. <laughs> this place is a lot less pretty now. Yeah, Ragnarok seems to be uh, putting a damper on certain places. Frontalheim's still doing pretty good, though. Spot of time, very, very pretty. All right, slide deposits and hack silver. Oh, heard something. Oh, I see something down there. I think. Eh, maybe not. A living desert. Huh. It was once full of life, you know, and music. The Song of the Sands, they called it. Gone now. Another victim of war. All right, another codex entry for that. Lore marker. The Living Desert. The Jewel of Alfheim is our most sacred and fertile desert, teeming with an unequal diversity of life. From the majestic Hafgufa, 
and their dulcet song of the sands to the wide array of turtles and lizards found in the Jata, and the abundant herds of gazelle and ibex roaming the shifting dunes. All creatures of the desert are given breath by the grace of the light. Take a moment to witness the grandeur and reflect. Keep well thy realm. So light elves live in a desert. I think it would make more sense for the dark elves to live in the desert. But I don't know. No near chest. What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the dark elves get on best they can. C R and N is what I'm looking for. I mean the dark elves are dead there so I'm just assuming well I don't I don't think they're all dead otherwise the war would be over uh, where the heck are these other ones there's one okay just need the R I know it's not actually an R, but I don't know what it is, so I'm calling it R. Alright, I'm thinking it's up there, maybe. So let's go back up. Perhaps we can reach that brazier from above. A brazier. Well, that's the idea I had anyway, but he sees something I don't. Shrine is at the top. Ah, yeah. How did you see that? Good eye. By frost eyes. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting on your chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. <laughs> Very well. Yeah, because your dad's smart. Take note, kid. Another apple. That might be a health increase. No, I need uh, two more. I'm looking for shinies. Returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. Oh, a raven. <laughs> Up to ten. Two more, and I get another reward. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Twilight stone will reflect an axe throw. Reflect indicator changes color when lined up with a target. What? Okay, so I want to like bounce it to something. Oh, let's just. Oh, maybe up. Um, well, that doesn't seem to be helpful. But let me show. There's a gap in the fence over there. Oh, I didn't know it could do that. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty nifty. 
Oh, very clever. I like it. These little punks. Whoa, they're getting exploded now? That's new. Alright, I don't need any rage. We're good there. So they can explode now, even better. Oh, hello. Oh. Get that! Oh, he got. Wow, that explosion hurts, too. Oh, dude, these guys suck. Mumia, do you understand these poems? Oh, there's always meaning if you look hard enough, brother. It's all in what you bring to it. Vassar's poems. Afterlife Abandonment. A Kavassar work of brilliance that, if misunderstood, proves the ignorance of the reader. Stick, rope, tar, black. Skin, handprint, baby crying. Shower stink, death beach, grubs, delicious. Bomb, piss. Death Stranding. Gothi's Edge, a tracking axe throw that ricochets between targets, marked by pressing R1 repeatedly? That seems dangerous. I don't know if I like the sound of that. High damage, though. Oh, <laughs> so it slows down time and then... Wait, what? Let me see that again. <laughs> it's like a Red Dead thing. <laughs> That's uh, unexpected. That that seems like it's just going to get me in trouble, but we'll try it out. Maybe it's better than it appears. But once again, the enemy's buffing up is not nearly as bad as the first the previous game. I keep saying the first game. What does ricochet mean? It just means to bounce something off of an object. Uh, okay, I can climb up, but... Oh, I guess I can go that way. Right. Actually, hold on. Any other things? No. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left. I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh no. Oh no, what? That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Oh boy. Yep. Inside, it's coming. <laughs> We're the ones who freed the light. All right, I do like that. That's interesting. All right, they don't stun for crap. Look at how much work that takes. Oh. Is that a bomb? I don't think I actually stun. I think the axe stuns better than the unarmored. <laughs> Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. I hate Alphonse. Hi, take this. Oh, I moved. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, do this. Oh yeah. Break that block. Oh my god. Nicely done, Kratos. Jeez. Most unfortunate. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. All right, that worked pretty well. <gasps> Back to full health. So weird leaving health behind. All right, check the sky. Wait, what's that over there? Is that something I can knock down? Wait, is that a wind chip? Can I summon the squirrel? Eh, now nah, they just break. Not the same wind chip. So last time we fought dark elves, this time light elves, apparently. We make everybody love us. Tribute to Freyr, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, Freyr's. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. All right, new codex. Oh, never mind, it's an artifact. Tributes to Freyr. Uh, dream Charm. This charm is meant to absorb nightmares. The principle behind such magic is not a local one, but a theory picked up by Tyr from the Western Lands. The premise is a simple one. Nightmares seek us out in the dark, hoping to crawl into our minds and corrupt them from within. Why is the reward thing in the way? There it goes. Uh, charms such as this are meant to distract and trap the nightmares, tangling them up in the charm's threads until sunrise can incinerate the devious bastards. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for this one. Oh, once again. And what's this thing? I think the same deal. Unless I can do something. I don't think so. Alright, so we've seen this in Svartalheim before. Whatever that requires, we don't have it. So we gotta leave that chest behind. Yeah, there's another one over there. And what is that over there? I don't think I can get to that. Oh, that's past that rock thing. It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. I'll go first. Petraeus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. 
Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, and Tyr, you keep pushing forward. Uh-oh, we broke the balance. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? We broke the yin and yang. What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. Oh, super cool. What did I see over here? Oh, it's just these weird, like, cosmic rocks. The Twilight Stones. Solid light. Guess some things don't change. Hmm. Well, we have a twilight stone. Oh, there we go. What if I hit it? Yes. The, door. the stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. Interesting. What's that sound? There's no sense in spoiling the surprise. But nice enough to leave all these vases behind so I can get a hacksaw. Alright, so we can go through there. Anything else? Mm, doesn't look like it. Whoa. It's the light! Ah. Ah. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power. And thus, the Light Elves were born. I love the look of this place. Such a nice change of scenery from all the, the winter-related stuff we've seen. Although, we were in Svartalheim for a while, which was also nice. Rawhide and Hex Silver. Uh. Alright, where's that going? Can't even tell. What am I trying to hit? I guess I'm trying to. Oh, I'm trying to hit those. Okay. But I might have to do a double ricochet or something. Oh, never mind. We can just do that. Well done. Though I imagine our light elf friends will be less than pleased. Speaking of light elves. Let me try talking to them again. Yeah. It's just to let these two do their thing, brother. Didn't work out for you, did it? Oh, is that a bomb? Right. Okay, I really like that, actually. I didn't think I would. Oh, man, it did a ton of stun, too. Holy crap. All right, it's good. Yeah, I, this is not... 
Uh, unarmored is not stunning like I thought it would. I think in the first game it did a lot more. Oh crap, I'm being dumb. Oh, dang it. That was silly. Oh yeah, you wanna play this game, huh? Have some of this! Tempted to use. Dang it. I'm tempted to use um, my uh, rage. Let me give it a second. Oh, okay. Rage time. And try to block my rage, silly. Here, they came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Guys, I saw us swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way, oh, I missed what we did. Oh, I missed it. Uh, the guys I saw playing this game on the lower difficulties, the unarmed was indeed stunning a lot. Seems like it got nerfed in the hardest difficulty. Well, that's the thing that often happens when um, people try to give me tips, which is why I uh, am not always the most... Uh, I don't always uh, <laughs> try things out that people suggest because they'll often make suggestions for lower difficulties. Like on Horizon, they're like, oh, just use this status thing that is like nearly impossible to apply on the higher difficulties. It's probably the same thing here. I'm sure on the lower difficulties, you can stun enemies much easier. Or maybe they have different upgrades. I don't, I don't know. But my experience is uh, I often get tips that don't work. So I uh, have learned to be more selective in what I try. All right, so what did, oh, he like just jumped across, I guess. Okay. Oh, I could push this down and now we can go back this way. Where are you going? He's just looking around. He does this sometimes. Ah, <laughs> curious mind. Carry on. I like that they keep acknowledging that I'm like sidetracking us. <laughs> That's cool. I'm a bit late to the stream, but I'm pretty sure you missed a raven at the start of the stream when you were still in the dwarf room right at the end. Just before you left, I could swear I heard it. Yeah, maybe. Um, we're definitely going to go back and, and finish up everything at some point. So. Do not worry if we missed anything, which we probably did. We will go back. But for now, we're in Alpha. Temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance the temple, and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. All right, we got one of those gold chests down below. That's interesting. If we can get down there somehow, it doesn't look like it. But good to know that that's around. Hmm, that's interesting. The shrine is this way, Kratos. Yeah, he knows. We just like to be thorough. 
<laughs> Again. I see. By all means, then. I love it. All right, these are the exploding ones, aren't they? Oh crap! Yes, they are. Bad. Oh, I hear a raven. Anything interesting this way? There is a raven somewhere. There you are. Ha! I can reflect it, I think. Hold on. I think I need a angle from up top, or maybe I can do like a double ricochet. Let's see. Ha! Nice. Bronze tier complete. Scholarly. All right, the Bri Bifrost Bridge. I know it is not uncommon to hear the voices of those we have lost in the light, so I decided to, ru to run one little experiment. With the permission of the temple's guardian, of course. I was missing my beloved Astriker, something terrible, and thought perhaps if I could hear him one last time, I'd feel more at peace. I packed up some of his favorite things, his blanket, the stuffed tatzel worm I enchanted to squeak when squeezed, and an old drake bone with the teeth marks still imprinted, and set them down near the light to see if I could perhaps call to his soul. I sat quietly for quite some time. I called to him. It was very difficult to confirm, but after a while, I swear I could hear the distinct sound of his paws on wood, gently clicking from his nails, just the way they used to sound at home. They grew close. My heart beat faster in anticipation, but as soon as the sound started, they faded and I heard no more. Perhaps I will try again one day, but for now, I will choose to believe he has found joy in the light and needs the comforts of his old life no more. I'm glad for him. Oh, what's this? Oh, never mind. Ah, there's the chest. Like, oh, get away from me. You get away. Oh, I can actually interrupt it. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I can't. I can't interrupt the unblockable, but not the explosion. Alright, what do we got? Eight. Glad we explored. Hades Retribution, a forceful stab that embeds a fiery bomb, which detonates after a brief delay. That sounds cool. Is that a light runic attack? It is. Hmm. I, I, I'm not liking my um, Flames of Anguish, though, so maybe this will work. What's weird, and I'm, I'm slowly starting to come around to the idea, is that I kind of like the AoE stuff in this game more, where AoE I hated. Anything that did area damage in the first game was like hands off unless I could do a huge spike of damage and kill multiple enemies. Which I event eventually got to that place, but certainly not at the beginning. Shall we continue? So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the dark elves want with it? to return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. All right, we can get some health. There's more twilight stone up there. Pretty sure I'm full health. Yeah. What's this? You're building quite the collection of poetry, brother. Why so surprised? My people are known for their culture. Not surprised. Esteem. Kavasir's poems in which Kavasser provides readers with their own tools for crafting stories. Visions after rest lay in wait for explorers. 
crafted by the imps and filled with music, joy, or horror. Among these fanciful realms lie endless creation and possibilities where the limit is one's own imagination. What game is this? It's not uh, Minecraft, is it? <laughs> I don't play Minecraft. So I don't know what's in it. Also, I'm pretty sure we never read the Light Elf's entry. Uh, we might not have. Let me see. I don't like that it's not showing me what's new. That's really terrible. <laughs> would it be under Bestiary? Ah, yes, it would. Light Elf. The discovery of the Lake of Souls marked the beginning of a great schism within Alfheim. The Light Well harnessed the power of the light, and the elves who spent their days ma basking in its glow became obsessed with their newfound power. They found new ways to express themselves through art and invention. It was a time of great prosperity for half of Alfheim. Once the realm's living desert began to wither, the other half of the realms deemed the cost of progress too high, thus spawning the violent circle of conflict that continues to this day. Knocking off their mask with a blow to the head can leave them open for strong attacks and easier to stun. Oh, really? That's good to know. Uh, okay, so I obviously need to do uh, reflection attack. There we go. Gotta be a better angle on that fire. Light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. You're not handling anything, Tyr. Oh, there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Light Elves, yeah. Mystic's Homing Orb, Thrown Weapons, will nullify this. Oh. Alright. Oh. oh, nice, it explodes. Uh, oh, crap. Whoa, what the hell? Oh, Alright, these guys are a pain. Oh, no. Uh, stop him! Ah, crap. I blame you, Atreus. You could have had that. My axe. Oh god! Oh god! Damn. Pain in the butt. Alright, hold on. There we go. That works too. Come here. Oh, I missed. Oh no, bad times. Oh, oh! I'm not gonna use my resurrection still in there. I'm just gonna take the death. Brother, get up! Brother! I reject your resurrection! Alright, these guys are actually... are actually difficult. Okay, we have to actually take these oh, guys there, seriously. Friends. Salutations, we mean you no harm. Use... Here. the thing. There we go. Get back. Dang it! Stop moving on me. <laughs> Knocked him right over the edge. Oh, there was another one. Crap. Oh, it's just a regular though. Oh, man. Don't you dare. Did I stop it? I think I did. I'm not sure. Oh, stop him! Stop him! We don't want him buffed. He's nasty. Oh, there we go. We got the status on him. Give me that. Give me that. Yeah, rip him in shreds. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. That's nasty. Get out of here. Nope. Not getting that crap. Crap. 
Stop him, Atreus! Actually, just kill him. That's better. And you. Oh, that was so smooth! Oh my god, that was so awesome. Nice. At least I tried. I get it now. Why they keep fighting? Dark elves want the souls and the light left alone. But the light elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. All right, so there's a chest over there. That's interesting. Oh, uh, lore entry. Yeah. Yeah, it's really annoying they don't put a indicator. Uh, light of Mystic. Mystics prefer to keep their distance, not emotionally. I'm sure they're quite forthcoming with their thoughts and feelings among their comrades. But as a battle tactic, they are masterful at conjuring difficult to dodge ranged attacks. That they are. Another chest over there. How do we reach it? We cannot. Let us continue. Hmm. hmm. Is that a challenge? <laughs> eh, I guess we'll continue though. I don't see a way. This might go around to it eventually. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Mm. Fortifications. Aye, none too eager to let the dark elves run the roost again. All right, so we can go down there. Oh, is that that chest that we saw? Or is that a different chest? Might be a different one. interesting it does I don't think that's the way up to the shrine we know there's a chest over here <laughs> oh I see it now forgive my impatience all right well I assume I want them at the same level oh tricky hmm. I don't think that's gonna work no I want a little too far I guess let's see Oh, I see it now. I can knock it down. Hmm. Oh, right. I have to throw a wall here. Alright, let's see. Maybe. Oh, that might work. Let me see. Uh, but now I don't have an angle. And that's. Not gonna work. Is there another one I could bounce off of? Not seeing one. Alright, what am I missing? Okay. It's close. Not gonna work. I don't mean to speak out of turn, but the white marble wall behind that grate. Perhaps your axe can reach it. Oh. 
<laughs> I just com Thanks, dear. My pleasure. completely on accident got it on the return trip. That's hilarious. Totally planned. Big brain moment there. Totally planned. Hilt of Graham. Once referred to as the Dragon's Bane, Graham isn't what it once was, but something, something, something. Uh, isn't what it once was, but will fell many more foes before its days are done. Grants a burst of rage and applies stun to nearby enemies. Upgrades increase the amount of rage gained. I'll try it, but I can't see that being that great. 119 seconds. Man. These cooldowns are crazy. Oh no. Oh boy. Above you, brother. Oh, that was crap. That's a gloom nightmare. Oh! Alright. Uh, beast. Gloom nightmare. Gloom nightmares are named appropriately, I suppose. They have the ability to temporarily blind their enemies. Unfortunate when it happens. But a few well-aimed hits with a ranged weapon and they'll bother us no more. Back to it then. <laughs> All right. So What will this do? Okay, and we get one of the uh twilight stones and maybe we can bounce it off of here. Can't hit that angle. Or maybe I can. I don't know. Come on. Come on. Okay. Come on. <laughs> you pain? Come on. Eh. Wow, this is a very precise. Can I get a different angle? <laughs> no. Yep. Oh my god, I missed it twice. Pro status. The angle looks right. Well then why isn't it working? Ugh. Come on. Oh my god, this is a pain. Is there like maybe I could like ricochet it off something else? What's, what's going on here? Oh, the height. Yeah, I can adjust the height. Derp. Thank you. I derped. Excellent. Let's continue our ascent, yes? For some reason, I like completely forgot that I pulled that down. Oh, here we go. Stay away from me. Oh, exploding nightmare. I feel like we've had those. Oh, crap. Behind me. Boom! <laughs> nice. Alright, health I don't need. Exploding nightmare this time. Perhaps the most deadly variant of Nightmare, these like to swarm an enemy in groups, and the moment they feel they have the upper hand, they sacrifice themselves for the good of, well, killing their enemy. Seems counterintuitive, counterintuitive if you ask me, but my theory is that they operate as some sort of singular consciousness. The good of the many makes losing a few worthwhile in the long run. 
As soon as an exploding nightmare begins to charge up, just one hit to their body will blow them up. The explosion hurts other enemies as well, which could prove to be useful when fighting a big group. If they get too close, they'll explode. Exploding nightmares need to be hit at range. So, which is your favorite of Gavassia's poems, brother? Why would I choose a favorite? All right, we got another one. Spirits Within Walls, a tale showcasing the power of visual art by Kvasir. A gentle boy and his brush found kinship along the walls. His creations, playful sprites, brought joy to one and all. The town, once empty, now flush with color and laughter. The boy hailed a hero, though merely a talented drafter. His mission, save his home, threatened by seas and disuse. His weapon, imagination, blues, reds, purple, and chartreuse. Uh, that is a game I have not played. Anybody know what game that is? I know of some, like, street graffiti game. Um, I forget what it was called. It was a Sony game, so it's probably what they're talking about. Concrete Genie or something like that? I don't know why that's... Ringing a bell. Concrete Genie, is that a thing? That just randomly popped into my head. Scribble Nuts? I don't know. Whatever it is, I haven't played it. I suppose I'll leave you to it then. Is this a new guy too? I think so. Yeah, he's powerful. What is he doing? Get out of here, you punk. Stabbed him! Oh man, he's got some health though. Oh, stop him! Oh, ow, right through my block. Oh, there's two of them, crap. Take some of this! Oh, he moved on me. That sucks. Oh, boom! Get out of here! I don't like you. Oh, where'd you come from? Oh! Mm, no. I don't. I want to use my stone for like a boss or something. This is a fine mess. I'm not gonna waste it on these punks. You know you can just shield bash them. Do you mean with my special shield ability or something else? I did not know that. I'll try it. I suppose I'll leave you two with Oh, he sliced me there. Watch your right. Dang it. That move sucks. It misses easily. Alright, we're switching off of that, I think. I want to get it to work one time just to see it, but it does not work so far. Oh, God. Alright, these guys are nasty. They get the rage. Light up warriors are mean. Trace just took that to the face. <laughs> oh man, alright. Yeah, that blue attack, I don't like it. I don't think I have enough time to shield bash him. I, if I tried to shield bash him there, I'm pretty sure I would've got hit. Shield bash is not a fast attack. Maybe like the exact instant that he started it. Whoa, Tyr can really jump.
That's why you use the smallest shield. Screw that. This shield's awesome. I love this shield. You can use the smaller shield. Oh, hey, did I find that chest? Heck yeah, this is the one. Concrete Genie, I was right. Sweet. I knew I saw that game somewhere. I don't know if that's the game they're talking about, though. They might have been Scribble Knots, which I don't know anything about Scribble Knots. But I've heard of it. Oh, can I backtrack for health? Uh, that's a good question. I probably can. I think I left some rage behind there, too. Ow. Oh, it might have disappeared. Wasn't it here? Yeah, I think it disappeared on me. Oh, well. We'll be fine. Oh, I forgot to try out my new uh, relic thing. Oh, spammers here. My mods might have uh, taken off for the night. Let me go I'll meet you go. on the other side. Alrighty. So, we can go down a little bit and then probably jump around. Before I do that, anything up here? No. Whoa! Tyr can really jump. So I can go there or I can go up here? Let's go up here. Oh, actually, no. I want to go the other way. There's twilight stone on the ground. Alright, well, hold that thought. I'm going over here. That's the wrong... Oh, I see. Another chest. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. I guess that's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Spartal Yoffer's counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now, too. Okay. Might be a few chests this way. What do we got over here? Go up there. Oh, I see. I can do a ricochet right here. Oh, but I need to turn it, maybe? Or can I just go from right here? No, I need to turn this thing. How do I turn it? I think I can grab it from over there. Wait, what? Oh. Okay. I see. I get it now. All right, now we quickly move over here. I thought I was just going to turn the thing, but that works too. Oh, is this going to be the right angle? I might need to be over there. Oh, wait. No, I'm dumb. I, I didn't have to go over here at all. I just need to stay where I was. I'm being dumb. All right, we'll get it. All right, right here. There we go. Ah, I see. The timing is What do we have? It's a gold chest. These are the good ones. Rune engraved release and accessory, a simple trinket signifying rebirth. Isn't that for Atreus? Weird. Is that in his armor? Oh, I can switch to him with R1. Yeah, okay. Hold on. Okay. The first runic arrow from a full quiver deals increased damage. Upgrades increase the damage dealt. Cool. I'll take it. Okay, I think we did everything over there. Oh. 
Oh wow, that was effective. We can continue up this way. Father, get me. over here. Anything for that? Nope. Come. Do what you must. Oh boy. It's a light orb. Oh my god, where did he come from? <laughs> what? Jeez, this out of nowhere just sliced me in the back. Oh man, that was brutal. I didn't even see him. I'm just dead. All right. Father, over here. It's not what I expected. It's that freaking warrior too. Here they come. Do what you must. All right, where did he come from? I didn't see him. Oh, there, I just dropped down. Oh, it's a regular one. What the? Get out of here, you punk. What's your life? Double tap L1 to enter. Oh, okay. Oh, man, I did not see that before. All right, well, my shield might be too slow for that, but we'll try it. Yeah, all right. Let's go. Ah, oh, God, where'd that come from? Boom! Oh. oh, he's gone. Ah, oh, well, I'm wasting my bomb. Oh. Is that because I knocked his helmet off? Oh, maybe that's the secret. Still can't figure out how they're making light bridges. Look at this statue. These crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. I wonder if this statue were to fall over the chasm. All right, well, let me explore first. Guess I could have been using the Twilight Stones to hit them with my yeah, axe, because that's so effective. Foundation's weak. Father could push this over, no problem. Yeah, 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 I'm looking around. Crystals still make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. Dude's got hops. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? Feels even taller on the inside. I can't believe all this was down here. Those are uh, such cool statues. I like that. No one here, chest. One we can actually do. Alright, so there's one. There's the other ones. There's another. Oh, those are easy. There's the third one. Maybe down here? Oh. Alright, so I need him to hit that. Ah, oh, the Nornir. Why 
Why must they insist on these frustrating trials? Oh. You would know better than oh. us. Oh. I can't remember the last time I visited the north. Nor do I wish to. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Terrible. Look, over there. Got it. Well done. Hey, blood me. One of three horns. Hello? Wars Dyer and Hexel. The little ones don't have any. What am I hearing? Something's groaning. Oh. And here we go again. Here we go again, indeed. Oh, here we go. I can actually use that against them. Let's see. Let's try this. Perfect. Take this. Oh, pain. Crap. No, stop him. Oh, wow. What the heck? Oh, all right, so go for the mystic or the warrior. The warrior is a pain in the butt to kill. The mystic will freaking bombard me like that. I don't know. I think the mystic is still the top priority. I'm gonna go for the mystic. And here we go again. Well, whatever, he's right here. I'm going for him. Right, he's actually dying pretty quick. Oh god, that attack is like that's like almost no tell to it. All right, there we go. I got my damn. You punk! Oh my god! Dude, where did that come from? What? Uh, I think some more showed. Yeah, some more freaking showed up behind me. I didn't see. All right. Finally, in a difficult combat scenario here. Let's see how we can improve. I might go back to my damage relic. And here we go again. Alright, learning his moves a little bit better. Okay, I can slightly beat them if I do it immediately with the double blue shield thing. Dang it! Oh my god, look how much damage that does! It's insane! God, I moved on me! Find 
There we go. Get out of my house. <laughs> I blew him up right into the light. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, crap. Oh, God. Oh, get the mystic. Get the mystic. Oh, yeah, he's squishy. Boom. <laughs> Come on, get him. Really liking those reflecting stones for the axe. It's awesome. Brighter than I remember. Mm. All right. Goodbye, bird. That's a fair few birds you've hunted. I wonder if it might be worth visiting the Raven Tree. All right, so we've got 12 ravens now, so we can get a new reward from the raven tree. Is that somewhere I can go? No. It's pretty, though. Some twilight stone on that statue shield. But that angle isn't gonna work. Okay, well, I saw something to the you right. Think there's yeah. any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have formed. But now, can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For Alfine, perhaps, but not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own paths, regardless of where they end. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> So many pots to break. Right, may as well knock this down. Okay, I can move that. Let me grab this first. And break the pots. What is that? Why is it moving? <laughs> That's creepy. Oh, wait. No. Let go. Alright, well, I'll break this off. Well, that didn't seem to do anything. What was the point of that? Okay, anyways. So. We need to get that shield dropped or something. Maybe there's another hold I could break. If I go like over here. Ah. I see it now. 
Let me move it to this side. Aha! The shield moved. Am I gonna get a shot in there? Maybe over here? Oh, reflect it into it. Maybe. I can't see. Ah, here we go. This will probably work. Yeah. That looks right. Nice. Am I going to have to be up here? Yeah, this should work. The last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartli Offer. We had to defend ourselves. But when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. Job, brother. This way, we're almost there. They probably shouldn't be putting their light crystals on the side that we're coming from, where we can just break them. Just saying, they probably shouldn't be doing that. All right, back outside. You get a cool view, or you still no. hear something wounded out there, Atreus. I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. Yeah, not the greatest view. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top, once we find our way past yet another light door. So fancy. Why is this shiny? I don't know. It's kind of weird. All right, there's the crystal. What's that? That looks breakable. There's some soundstone up there. It pairs quite nicely with the twilight stone. A knack for interiors, these light elves. What, what are you guys seeing? Oh, over here maybe? Ah, there it is. Go. Ah, it's facing the wrong way. Hmm. Maybe if we allow me to speed this up. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. That still looks like something, doesn't it? I don't know. That's suspicious to me. Oh, wait. I didn't see this. It is suspicious. What can we do with this? Your father is indeed thorough. Limitless. Limitless what? Power? Growth? Ambition? A bit vague, isn't it? Limitless. I'll give this to the Light Elves. The beauty of this temple is unmatched across the Nine Realms. To thank only two winters ago, all of this was uncovered by Hive and Darkness. Or all of this was covered by Hive and Darkness. I'm sure there was beauty in it, in its own way. But what can I say? White marble and gold trim is much more fetching. Oh. 
Rawhide and Hacksilver. All right. Ah, oh, the light of Alfheim. How stunning. Nothing. What's wrong? I could hear Mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When Father went inside the light, he you said he... You went inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. Groa's triptych. All right, I don't see anything else nearby. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least. Father, she's... she's gone. Yes. Keep moving. Interesting. We're almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this hive stuff up here. So many Dark Elves. I... All this time, I thought the Dark Elf King... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. We've got Dad 2 here. <laughs> I, I guess Uncle Tyr. Two gods of war. One who's completely given up war, and the other one who grumpily is getting involved. Wait, where'd they go? Oh. Alright, let's go. Guess this is it? 
look around. Yeah. It's through there, maybe? But there's this. I could have jumped to that, maybe? What is that for? I don't know. That one's suspicious. Is there something I could have done? I don't know. Anyways, let's go through the door. Hmm, reflecting stones here. Such a beautiful area. <laughs> Crap, look at this. Oh, I know where we are. We're at that lake. Yeah, that's right. Okay. I remember it now. Looks a little bit different, doesn't it? This game looks unbelievable. Thank you for streaming. My pleasure. I'm having a blast. This feels like a perfect area for a raven, right? Look who it is. Hi, Sindri. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? My, someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the Light Elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two-year. Very messy. Anyway, good luck! Alright, well. Let's see what we can learn. The Giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he had, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be me you assume too much aye best not to read into these abstractions so literally prophecies are slippery by nature although some are more obvious than others ragnarok aye the end of everything so this is it there's nothing we can do to stop it there must be a way why else is this hidden 
Look, here. This is what we saw. It's you, fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't... I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? But the other realms thrive? She did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay. Whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, him. Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. can't stop Ragnarok, but we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. All right. Guess we're going back inside to descend the light well. Something tells me more elves. Perhaps there they are. Focus on our egress first. Agreed. One of Be careful. Oh crap! Thought it was destroyed. All right, only give it to you real quick. Dang it. Oh, that's right. They gain the level when they buff up. I forgot about that. I think they did that in the first game, too. Take some rage. Oh, there's my axe. Hey, my axe back. There we go. All right, we got a new codex entry for the elves. Light elf. Uh, when they throw explosive material, here's an idea. Throw it right back at them. Wait, what? How? That's interesting. I don't know how. Oh. Crap! Oh, I forgot I can't block that. Let's see, get that. Oh, I got the helmet off. Alright, cool. Oh, okay. Getting used to that. Alright, they're not that bad once I got used to the other- Oh, stop them! Never mind. 
Cancel this. Oh, no, I can't cancel it. Dang it. Alright, what was that? Uh, Light Elf Warrior then just updated. Where is it? Uh, see if you can parry his dashing slash to open him up to counterattack. Oh, I could have done the reflex thing. Oh well. Well, hello. Some of this. Not that. Oh my god, that does a lot of stun. Oh! Wow, that was easy. <laughs> Who's after me? Uh, there they are. Oh, that was terrible. Down he goes. Shrimps are here. Wait, what the heck? <laughs> I put a bomb on the little dude. <laughs> a little overkill. That's fine. like an area that should have had something. Quickly now before more arrive. Oh. Little shrimps. Give me this. Wait, what the heck? Why would I go this way? Well, now I'm curious. We'll check that in a second. These things smell awful. Behind you, brother! Who's after me? Oh, you. Oh, what the heck? I was blocking! I can't go that way for some reason. What the heck? Hello? Uh. Alright, that's weird. Maybe we went this way before. I don't remember this part though. Alright, whatever. This way! What the heck? I didn't even see it. I saw her do the oh, I saw her do the attack, but then I didn't see the the, the bomb. Wow, I went all this way for a health. <laughs> a lot of good that did me. All right, I could go that way. Oh, well now I got no choice. Guess we're going this way. <laughs> Oh! 
All right, all the. Oh, rude. Oh god. I get it. <laughs> you think that blue shield's gonna save you? Not gonna happen. Get the mask? Oh, rude. I'm trying to get that mask off. I guess it stuns her, though. Oh, big explosion. Wasn't expecting that. Oh, brutal. Here, give me up, Atreus. Oh, wow. What are you supposed to do when she's that at distance? I can't shield strike her from a mile away. Oh, so yeah, same thing. Oh, man. All right. Uh, I got to figure out what to do about those explosions. I can't stop them. I can stop the one that was near. Well, I can't stop if I can just get away. Oh, got me good there. Man, she's fast. Oh, yeah, I hit the wrong button. Dang it. Oh, terrible. Oh, she moved. No. Oh, 
Ready. Get away. Perfect. Peter up, Atreus. Trap, see? Like that. What? I can't shield strike from a mile away. I don't understand. Right, give me that health. Give me that health. No, no, no. There we go. Oh my god! <laughs> Brutal. Tear? Are you okay? No. Poor Tear, forced to kill. Rond of Expedition, shield detachment, a shield rond that hastens recovery when used to ward off impending doom? Huh? Grants a blessing of cooldown when interrupting double blue ring attacks. Double tap, L1, or parrying. Okay, shield run. Hmm. Defense and cooldown. Mine is giving defense vitality and luck. I think I want to stick with what I've got. Yeah. I think so. It is over. It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight, but with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. Oh no! No! Atreus! Sir. Hey, dear. Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I. No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. Man, that elf just chopped off its own leg? Was that... Just sliced it off? I don't need that. We didn't read the boss lore? Thank you for the reminder. 
Because the game's certainly not going to remind me. Uh, bows. Alva. Winters ago, we defeated the Dark Elf King... Oh, jeez, those names. Svartoljafer. It appears in his absence, a new guardian of the Temple of Light was anointed. Her swordsmanship and command of her form was unlike any I have gone up against. She was the aggressor, but once again, Atreus questions if we have helped the wrong side, referring to the struggle between the Light and Dark Elves. The only side we can take in this conflict is our own. How do I like Ragnarok so far? It's great. Look, I just want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Only slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough. We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. Oh, you thought it cut Tyr's leg? No, it cut its own leg off. <laughs> or whatever limb that was. It's hardcore. Alright, make your way to the Mystic Gateway. Is this the way we came in? No, this is different. Or is it? Maybe this is the way we came in. Oh! Dark Elf Assault. How fortuitous. I'm so sick of fighting out. Oh, they're back. <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> he bugged out a little bit. Ah, oh, dang it, I got distracted and let him buff up. Alright, the dark- what the heck is wrong with that dude? Alright, we're just gonna let Spaz do whatever he's doing. <laughs> oh, there we go. Stop him, Atreus! There we go. Alright. We need to get out of here. Through here! Wait, what? Oh, through here. Or anything? No. Well, they don't have Alva anymore, so presumably we're gonna help the Darkos win this time. Oh, rage! Nah, I don't need that health. What else we got? You're just chilling. Nobody cares. Oh dang it! I didn't mean to grab that. Grab this. Boom! Sucker. Right side, brother. <laughs> All right, now what? Through there, okay. Anything else? Let's go, let's go! Oh, heck yeah, here we go. Here we go, boom! Oh, what the heck? Oh, I forgot about that crap from the first game. Oh, you stay away from me. Man, this guy's not staggering at all. Ah, he buffed up. Dang it. Behind you. 
Oh, I'm gonna hit him with that reflex. Oh, never mind. Oh my god. They're relentless. Of course, he's all buffed up. Ah, oh, crap. Hey, get away from me. Can't even see. All right, I think he killed him. Nice. Man, get tricky. Tricky. Ah, oh, dang it. Missed. Nope, you ain't doing that. Oh, cut him in half. Oh. All right, let me uh, check the codex for these. Elves, Dark Elves, seldom does power come without cost. Alfheim's desert wasn't always a storming and barren wasteland. No, before the temple was built, the desert was teeming with life. Now the light-deprived elves of the barrens wage constant war upon their counterparts in the light well. In their eyes, the Lake of Souls is not theirs to use. How could one blame them? They watched their home waste away as their cousins grew powerful. Dark Elves pre prefer a tactic of swarming you as a group, disrupt their efforts with heavy hits and parries, Dark Elves may recover in the air from being launched, but not if you launch them once frosted. Then the Dark Elf Warrior, a bit tougher than most Dark Elves, these warriors spend their time training and executing routines to the most efficient and deadly extent. As with most Dark Elves, flight remains an important part of their strategy. Should they attack, the sooner we can ground them, the sooner we can get the upper hand. Their charge attacks cause temporary blindness, which I know you especially hate. They are much easier to kill when grounded. Trip them up if you have the chance. And I think we had all those before. Up here. All right. This area over here. Let's go. Let's keep moving. Alright, it's time to get the hang of the combat again. Light him up. That was a fun fairy. Alright, there we go. Where'd the other one go? Oh, did he just fall off somehow? I guess so. Hey, give me that. Uh, hello? Hello? Can, can I have that? Apparently not. Weird. All right, well, this is bugged out. I can't get it. Two bugs. I haven't seen like any bugs the entire playthrough, and then we get two in a short span. Wait. Wait, I can't grab this one either. What the? Oh, my. Oh, it thinks I'm still in combat. Wait, where did he go? He's all jacked up. All right. Oh, crap. Ah, yeah.
Okay. I guess the bug was that that guy disappeared. Oh god! She's slippery. Alright, what the heck is her deal? I haven't even hit her. Oh, dang it! Alright, I don't know what that was. Dark Elf Summoner. Come here. Crap. Ah, he countered me. Oh, no, I missed. That was terrible. Not that it mattered. All right. I think we cleared it all out. Can we leave now, please? Almost there. What do you this think way. we're trying to do, dear? They're attacking us. Hey, we made it. Wait, is this where we started? Here, it is. We... Open the gateway, please. Yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. Wait, where's he going? Andreas? Return to Sendry's one right away. Have we gone this way? We have not gone this way. Alright, well, let's check it out. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now, I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Good. Yeah, lead the way. Wait, you saw a raven? I think I do actually hear one. There right now. Maybe. No, I don't hear anything. Oh, anyways. What's this? Vulture's gold, a treasure map. Find the location from the map. Hmm. That looks like the uh, mouth of a giant creature. Uh, in search of peace, the beast finds only war. Its last breath of life atop the sands. Its last meal of gold beneath the bones. Uh, 
Alright, new region discovered. The canyons. Oh, I gotta remember to ask Tyr about his travels to the lands beyond the seas. You wish to travel the world? I don't know. Maybe. See new places. Find out more about myself. Hmm. I right, got some hacks on be able to reach the barons up top once we find a way past this hive matter. I remember these things. Definitely dark elf territory. I definitely remember these things. <laughs> Wait, can't go through there? Oh, he just cleared this out. Okay. What the heck is that thing? That's cool. Oh, that's a raven. Wait, where'd he go? Hey, come back here. Ah, crap. Oh, there he is. Ooh. Does he come around? Ah, oh, he comes around that way. Let's see. Thirteen. Hail, Misty. fellow travelers. Oh, he's got a favor. What is this favor? Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know Alfine pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I... Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is stickier than I care for. Good luck on your search, though. Secret Stuff some of cloth the sand. In your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. Find a way to reach the pained creature. Okay. Surprised to see you out here, Sindri. You must hate the sand. Oh, it is the worst. But with Brock banned from Alfheim, it's up to me to keep you ship shape and sharp. So why is Brock banned from Alfheim? Oh, that's, um, I don't know if, well, do you know what a juicy Noken is? No. Well, thanks to Brock, the elves sure do. Uh, what is a juicy... No. Well, now I want to know. <laughs> what is it? Oh, Leviathan Axe upgradable. Wait, when did I get a frozen flame? Huh. I got a frozen flame. Wow, we are definitely upgrading. This axe just keeps getting stronger. Boom. Almost level three. We're getting there. Uh, let's see. He's got new craftable armor. Anything I want? Strength, defense, and runic? Ooh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Let's see. This one... I can compare the two, that's right. Thank you for the reminder. Oh, that's a huge strength loss for defense. That is a huge strength loss. Yeah. Plus it's for Frost Awaken and Flame Whiplash, which I rarely use either of those. So maybe not worth it. It's a lot of stats though. It's a lot of stats. But I think I'm gonna say no to that. What about this wrist armor. Let's see. Compare those two. 23 strength and vitality versus 20 strength and runic. Runic attacks do increase damage against status afflicted enemies. Or reduce how quickly enemy stun bars drain. Those are both roughly equal in my mind. I like the vitality currently. Although the runic's starting to get pretty good. I do like that throw I have. I should probably switch my blade ability though. I'm not enjoying that one as much. Uh, let's see. And then compare that and that. Uh, lose 9 defense. Gain 13 
Lock, or sorry, 13 runic instead of lock. Less stats overall. And these increase healing, which I do like. I think I'm going to keep what I have. They're interesting, but I don't think they're good enough. Uh, let me make a new resurrection stone. Oh, never mind. I, I still have mine. Disregard, I will sell my artifacts. And in pristine condition, too. This must be from Alfheim. Explains the, uh, ugh, sand. Alrighty, let's explore. What is this? Oh, something after me. Do it quick. Oh, what the heck? Oh God, what is that? Unaterliker? <laughs> Two golems sit in front of this marker that says unnatural. They're tied to a sled and completely calm. Strange, how long have they sat here? They're just as well behaved as Specky and Spana. So, it looks like I could sled around. What are these animals? Gulon, native to Vanaheim. Not sure what they're doing here. Well, I guess we'll go for a ride. Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated Gulon. Most unusual. <laughs> oh, good. I can break the things for resources. Oh, well, hello. Oh, this is a gold one. It's in here. Oh, never mind. I thought it was like the gold chest. <laughs> Flag deposits, sweet. Any particular direction to find your wounded animal? Or are we just enjoying the weather? I can't hear anything out here. Perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings. Press L1 or circle to slow the slide, okay. Man, you can't see anything out here. What's that glowy thing? What is that? A lore? Oh, it's a chest. A tempting treasure chest! Damn the sand! Oh. It's a scam. It's a scam chest. What is this? Oh man, like everything's buried. Cool-looking little lizard things. This cave extends underneath the desert. Is the creature within? Yeah, sounds like it. We'll ah. find it if we keep going. What is this place? A refuge for the dark elves, by the looks of it. One of the few remaining now that they're barred from the temple. <sighs> Great. <clears throat> we discovered the below. Oh, 
go. Oh, stop it. There we go. Man, he's got some health on him. Yeah, I can see the uh, extra health that those are giving me. It's not a ton, but it's pretty good. All right, how are we gonna do this in time? Aha! Fancy. Right there. <laughs> Just keep doing it. Almost full health. Okay. More reflecty things. Alright, full health. Nice. That'll come in handy. Oh, he got me. Oh, no, he didn't. He missed. Oh, boy. Hmm, who do I want to go for first? I'm going to say him. Oh, he got me. Ah, crap, he's buffing up and I was not ready. Oh, what was I doing there? That was terrible. I'm just gonna let him die. Not using my resurrection stone on this regular group. All right, we can do better than that. Let's leave that health there. There we go. Dang it. A little squishy, actually. How does it, oh, it misses all the time. I gotta move that ability off, I hate that thing. Oh, he got me with a follow up. How rude. Much better. You know, now that I know more about the Dark Elves, I wish we didn't have to fight them. They attack us. Well, this is their home. And considering what happened the last time we were in Alphamon, can you really blame them? Hmm. What's the trick here? Not seeing any reflecting stones. Unless 
Oh, up there. Ah, I see. That's easy. Can I check uh, Discord after stream if you remind me? Because <laughs> I tend to forget. Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader. Hey, bonds tier complete for wall art. New rune read Patience. Patience, found deep within a dark elf cave, they must use these as outposts to launch raids on the temple. A useful spot to watch their enemy and plan their next assault. Rawhide, Dwarven Steel, and Hex Silver. I think Dwarven Steel is new. Don't believe I've seen that before. Dead end? Or near chest. Interesting. Well, one of them's in here, surprisingly. Is there a way to take down the wall? I don't think so. Okay. I mean, I could potentially leave my axe behind and then recall it to hit. That could work. Is that a bucket up there? It is a bucket. I think it is, at least. Yeah, it's a bucket. Hey. There we go. What's this? Shat wow, ten shattered runes? Holy crap. That's a lot. I hear those little creatures... I don't see any way to fight them. Huh. Not sure how to get to that Nornir chest. The creature you heard. What does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just... I feel what they're feeling, you know? And whatever this thing is, it's in a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. Okay. Even Atreus is confused by Kratos' softer side. 244 hack silver. We're starting to get a lot more hack silver. That's for sure. Probably don't need to be quite as conservative in what I'm choosing to upgrade. Let's see, we got a little reflecty thing there, but I need a different angle. Will that work? No, that's still wrong. Hmm. Oh, what's down here? Oh, it's an audio chest. Interesting, so I think my idea... Oh, wait, I can just open that. Oh, dude, move! Oh, my God, Kratos. What the heck? So, actually, it looks like I can just open it. So, we know where two of them are. Where's that third one at? Hmm. Not sure. Oh, maybe in there? No. Wouldn't be able to hit that. Maybe up here? No. Let's be inside. Uh, it must be in here. Maybe not. Huh. 
C, R, and N. Sometimes... I think the... The order actually indicates its position, but I could be wrong. Hmm. I don't think it's in here. Wait, what the heck? Where do those enemies come from? I gotta go fight them. Wait, did they just die? Uh. Okay. Alright, what the heck? Where is this thing? Probably gonna be in some super obvious spot and I'm gonna feel dumb when I finally find it. Oh, is that it up there? What is that? Maybe that's it. Yeah. Let me go up there though. That it? Oh, yep, that's it. Okay, I found it. Very spread out. Uh, Alright, well, we're gonna have to clear this out. But how? Maybe from over here? There we go. Oh, that was the loot creature that hides? Interesting, I probably have to do a, a ricochet to kill it. I still... He's still gone, though. I didn't actually kill him, right? Or did I? Well, whatever. He'll be back. Yes, presumably, at some point. or enchanted rings or whatever much has changed for both of us well yeah i'm just trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal is this not what you want no no it, it is i'm just surprised it's what you want too I gotta go that far just to open this thing? Interesting. And then... Oh, hey! It goes inside. Oh, no, this is a different spot. Oh, never mind. Alright. Alright, so I can hit that and then quickly run over. But will that be enough time? Let's find out. I'm gonna assume not, though. I think I might have to do like an axe recall to make that work. Oh, never mind. Easy. I got another apple. One more, and my maximum health will increase. Okay, so you said if I go up here, the little creature dude will appear. I think I just heard him. Yep, okay. Good call. Let's see, why is that not working? Looks like it's right on him. Well, let's try it. Nope. Or do I just hit him? Oh, I just hit him, huh? There we go. Thanks, Green. <sighs> 
so many goodies. What do we got? Honed metal. Shattered runes. Dwarven steel. Stone wood. And health. I don't think I actually needed that health. Whatever. I took it. I took it all. Okay. Well, only way to go is this way. Who are you? Oh god. Ew. Oh, it's like a boss dude. Oh man, how did he get me with that? Bring it. I'm ready. This dude is so annoying. <laughs> <laughs> ah, crap. Behind you, look out. Where is he? Oh, there's multiple. Oh, God. Stun locked me. Jeez. Right. Kill his little friends. God! Worst! Oh god, there you are! Rude! Here, have some of this. Ah, you punk. Ah! Where'd he go? Dang! Oh, he got me! What? That charge was so quick. Come on, team I, I dodged board. too. He still got me. Oh, that was brutal. All right, I'm ready for him this time. Yeah, have some of this. Oh, he's almost done. Ah. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Wait, who's buffing? Oh my, there's three? Oh, stop! Hey, oh, Trey is too slow. It was totally you, not me. <laughs> Are you sure we're doing the right thing? If you wish to abandon this creature, we will leave. Well, no, I don't want to abandon it. But if we have to kill a bunch of dark elves to get there, 
I remember a young lad who, until this very moment, would take on an army of Draugr to save a wounded animal. But these aren't undead Draugr. They're elves. I just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes. Getting involved where we shouldn't. Hey, he's learning. Okay, anything else in here? Came from over there. Who here? I think. Oh, got another health. Eh, I'm missing just a little bit. I'll take it. Exploding material. Alright, what we got here? We got these. Looks like we can bounce it off a mirror, but we gotta clear that first. Maybe I can hit that. There we go. And then I need a much better angle for that. Here we go. from here. There we go. Nice. Am I going to end the stream after finishing the side quest? Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to quit halfway through. Hopefully it won't be too much longer. Looks like we're getting close-ish. It's the little shrimps. Oh god. Right, I gotta remember that the unblockable is not the same as the uh, explosion. If I can just attack through the uh, unblockable, that's fine. Alright, what's this? No. Nope. That's not gonna do. Oh, maybe I could do like a. One of these deals, and then... Oh! Wait, hold on. Can I get it on the return? Oh, it's close. Hold on. A little bit higher. No? Hold on. Let me, let me go a little further. Got it! <laughs> oh, I love that. That's awesome. That's super cool. Okay. Seems like a trap, doesn't it? I don't trust this at all. But no, we're good. 243 hack silver. Uh, what is this monstrosity? Oh, I see. Or maybe I see? I could bounce that off, but to what end? Oh wait, I think I went too far with it. Maybe like this? No. Doesn't make any sense. Huh. Maybe maybe I just do this. And then this. Ah oh, no, that doesn't work at all. Hmm. It's a weird one. Very weird one. It regenerates. I'd have to do it in one throw for it to make any sense. How would I do that? Maybe something like this? No. Maybe I gotta go up top. Maybe that's the trick. Let me try. Um, there. Right, now 
What's the deal over here? Through here? Look there. That bomb should help us out. It's just... Why does it feel like no matter what we do in Alfarn, we wind up hurting Dark Elves? We are down here to help the creature you hurt. I know that. But I'm usually the one who drags us around trying to rescue animals. Why do you care so much? Is there something you're not telling me? No. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's try this. No. That's not the right angle. Oh, hold on. And then it's going to bounce off of that. That could work. There we go. That'll work. Forged Iron Dwarven still on Hack Silver. Okay, this could actually work. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Easy. Easy. All right, anything else over here? No, nope, I think we're good. Oh, right side. we got. Get out of here. Thank you, Atreus. Crap. It's down. Double kill. I don't want. It's weird that Atreus can shoot them and they don't explode, but. Oh, it's a hive! I didn't know these things had hives. Did they have hives in the first game? I don't think they did. All right, they have hives too. Maybe they did. I, I can't remember. No hives in the first game? Right, I guess that's new. What the heck? Found it. Jellyfish. Gefune's ghost! That's the largest bloody half you I've ever laid eyes on! It's not just in pain. It's trying to sing. It's the song of the sands. They don't normally sing like this underground. Is that what's causing the storm? Aye. Judging by all this hive matter weighing it down, it's been trapped here for dozens of winters. Don't worry. I'll get you out. Knows its name? What is that name? Well... The last good thing we saw was Diener, so... Oh boy. While I appreciate the attempt at humor, that little brother is truly awful wordplay. Embarrassing, really. Oh, well, can't all be winners. Oh, Trace has to give up his comedy career already. only gonna get two. Oh wait. Ah, reflecty thing. Hard to see. Oh, I missed.
Looks like he can move now, but it still can't get out. Much of the hype matter is gone. We can free it from the surface now. On the surface? Open the hive cage on the surface. Oh, they caught it. I thought it just got trapped on accident or something. They actually captured Why did they trap it down here? Hafgifas are known to burrow, so I'd hesitate to place full blame on our dark elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the dark elves. Any more than the light belongs to the light elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources. One the elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the light elves seem keen to banish the hive over on their side, the dark elves make effective use of it out here in the barrens. So, by clearing out all of this hive, are we hurting dark elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved? <sighs> no. Then let us free it. Atreus learning that not everything is black and white. He's growing right before our eyes. Maybe the sandstorm will stop and you'll be able to get the stuff buried in the sand as well. That would stand to reason. There was that little cave area I couldn't seem to enter and there was that chest. I'm sure there was more. But that's at least what we're aware of right now. What is that? Oh, can burst through the top. All right. Do it. Ooh, gold chest. Heck yeah. Give me the loots. Give me the loots. Whispering slabs. Five of them. I'm still not sure what those do. Oh, shoulder straps of radiance, chest armor, a beautifully crafted armor found in the barons of Alfheim. It shares the radiance of the realm itself. And that is level four armor. Very nice. Oh, jeez. 34 strength, 20 defense, 17 runic, and 17 luck. Plus evasive focus. Moderate luck chance to grant a blessing of runic on any last second of aid. A beautifully crafted armor found in the Barons of Alfheim. It shares the radiance of the realm itself. Do that comparison. And it blows it out of the water. But what if... Oh, I can't check if it was rank 4. What would happen? I'm still assuming these would be better because... This is good. We're gonna put these on for sure. Kind of ugly, but uh, stats are nice. And it got me to level three. Nice. Very nice. All right, just hit that. Oh, you like the way they look? I mean, they're not bad. I, I'm not a huge fan of them, though. Let's see. Where is it imprisoned at? Help me out, map. I can't see. All right, apparently it's over here. Well, I guess we'll take the dogs. Oh, I think it's right here. That looks like a cage to me. Yeah, this thing? I think so. Unless it's over there. Oh wait, that's that treasure map I had, I think. Well, let's see. Yeah, this is it. This is the spot! We can cut the half goofa loose here. It's a half goofa. Sounds much happier now. And hey, the storm's gone. Aye, perhaps we'll finally earn some goodwill from our dark elf friends after all. Look, Father, thanks for bringing us out here, but you don't have to do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered 
He just wants to spend time with you, lad. While he still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead. But if Ragnarok approaches, I wish to enjoy the time we have left. I... I don't know what to say. Thank you for bringing us out here. I'm glad we did this. As am I. <gasps> All right. We got rid of the sandstorm. Got an Odin Raiden over there. I should hit that really quick. Let's see. Long distance, though. Let's see. Can I nail it? I'm going to say right there. Oh, not even close. <laughs> I thought... I think I thought Kratos socks. had a... What has happened? They're wet. They will dry. You know, I just knew you were gonna say that. Then why did you ask? I'm really not sure. They will but, dry. Yeah, I'm sure they will. I thought Kratos had a better arm than that. Alright, let's see. Uh, new codex entry... Lore? Hafkufa. We've discovered that the source of the sandstorm in the Barrens was a creature Mimir calls a Hafgufa. I encountered something like this as a boy, but it was a much smaller sea creature that did not fly. Now that the storm has subsided, we can explore the desert freely and collect resources. To the west, we can see another sandstorm, likely caused by another Hafgufa. We should ease this creature's pain when the time is right. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing with the treasure map. It's right there. Alright, can you at least throw that far, Kratos? No. What the heck, Kratos? We believed in you. There we go. 14 of Odin's Ravens. Let me just break these barrels really quick. We'll get the treasure map, and I think that'll be a stopping point There's for us. There's something I'm not sure I quite understand. In the Ragnarok prophecy Odin made, all the realms get destroyed, including Asgard. In the version Groa kept secret, Asgard still falls. Wouldn't Odin have tried to prevent it either way? What difference did her life really make? I think of it this way. When it comes to subverting prophecy, knowledge is power. Without the full picture and context, the finer details can lead you to tragically incorrect interpretations. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain coven of heathwitches who were keen on destabilizing the government. They picked an influential thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. They dressed it up in enough details they knew would come to pass, so when they did, the thane took it as confirmation. Next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Murders many he once called friends, too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing touch, the witches revisit this usurper with just a few details structured ever so misleadingly they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats physical or magical. magical aye aye but was not so for him all turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go the thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed none dare speak it all thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy you really gotta write these stories down one day, Mimir. Well, I try. Sure, claims to get sore. But thank you, lad. Alright, what do we got here? Excellent. <laughs> Just out here breaking barrels. This isn't the one we saw before, but I'll take it. Mimir, you said souls come in four parts. Does that mean you can lose some of your soul, but not all of it? Aye. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Lose any one of them, and the entire being suffers. Still, sometimes luck alone is enough. Just ask your father. My success does not come from luck. Ah, the refrain of the eternally lucky. <sighs> Alright, this is the treasure... Map place, clearly. Where is it? Oh! It's not like a raven. It is a raven. There's a raven nearby. What's this? Shattered runes and stonewood. Treasure map is complete. 
Dwarven Steel, Hone Metal, and Kratos Experience. Not a whole lot. Oh! Lethal Detonation Accessory. Unstable Gemstone, Craving Death and Destruction. Let's see. That's under Armor, under Atreus, Accessory, and he's got three now. Accessories are equipped to him. I know that. Rune and Grade Release. Oh, wait, what? It moved it. This little detonation. Enemies killed from a runic arrow explode, dealing moderate damage around them. Upgrades increase the damage dealt. Alright, whatever. They all seem pretty meager. They all seem like huge deals. Where's this? There he is. Fifteen ravens. Alrighty. Well, that seems like as good of a stopping point as any. Let me go ahead and save. Alright, that is going to be it for tonight. Uh, yeah. Continues to be great. I don't really have anything to say. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm loving the game. Uh, having a lot of fun with it and uh, getting used to the, the, the differences to the combat and some of the changes. Definitely didn't struggle tonight with really anything. There was no hateful <laughs> equivalent tonight. Didn't get my butt kicked in, in that regard, so it went well. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow night I'll be playing Saints Row, potentially finishing it. We shall see. Uh, for those of you only interested in God of War, I'll be back on uh, Tuesday of next week. Thank you all for watching. Hope you had fun, and I will see you all next time.